it's spring break time, March 16th, Saturday. Current temperature 85 degrees Fahrenheit. There is a curfew in effect for Miami Beach. Right. There's no on-street parking in Miami Beach. They've instilled uh, strict rules now because... So I'm probably doing a drive-through, but we'll see. Because of the problems that happened during spring break last year. Hey, Stuart Bryce. Hey, Elena. Hey, Anne Darling. Now, again, we apologize to all our Patreon and YouTube members who did we not no get service. advanced notification of this live stream. It's we tried. Crazy. We tried for the last half hour and we had no service um, in like the edge of downtown Miami. I don't know if they were jamming the signals, but I it's mean, jamming me. I'm nice not, boat down there. not really sure. Let me show you the Ooh, view from the one. side window. Look how beautiful it is. I'm not sure, you know, how. We got hands, baby. What? We are not sure how strict that it's going to be as far as parking. Well, and... I said there's none south of uh, 16th Street. Right, but the garages, they said they're Garage charging a hundred dollars. You know, we're gonna we're gonna investigate. Th right. There's a lot of things that are said, but until you go and check them out yourself. Proof is in the pudding, guys. Right, you, know you, you have to find out, you know, for sure, for sure. For sure, for sure. So for let's real, go to for the, real. Go to the front view again. Gorge says the aliens got out of hand yeah, they during did. spring break. Vincent Padula is asking, how Take is everyone? Me to your leader. Oh, everyone's hey, great. Hey, Vincent, pop it in. Vincent and George, pop it in. Thanks nice for job. watching, guys. That's a fantastic job. Thanks. We're looking forward to hanging out with you a while and breaking this all down for you. You may see it on the news. We're here in Miami Beach, guys. Right. You may see this on the news and think it's, uh, you know, a war zone down here. And it's not. Right. Every spring break we've done, I think it's a fact of 98% of the kids that come down here are good. You have 2% right. knuckleheads to get all the press. Right. I think a lot of the problems were later at night when we weren't um, really, you know, in the area anyway. So, guys, this is, you see, sobriety checkpoint. Yeah. We really haven't started any of that yet. Yeah, no I Guinness. guess that's maybe like later in the evening. So, we're now in the area called south of 5th because we, we're in and Miami we're Beach now. we the whole Washington Right. Our plan is to check out the whole situation. With, the whole Magilla. Right. If we can... The whole kit and caboodle. If we can park for less than $100, the, the, we'll, we'll park. But, I mean, I don't think we're going to be able to because... Show Hudson. Hudson is Hudson here. is in the back seat. Now, for our Patreon and YouTube members who have access to early videos, you will notice a new blanket that Hudson is laying on. Uh, this was gifted as a birthday gift for Mr. Hudson. Look, no, look no at this. loud no music loud no music. honking. No honking, no All loud music. All the ducks music. are saying right now, the ducks are, you know, they're no saying. No loud Burr. music, no Burr. honking. Burr. Brendan Nelson's saying hi. No duck honking, guys, you know that. So we're here in Miami Beach and we're gonna show you, we're gonna show you the beach. There's someone getting their bags dropped now, off. Oh, you know, I don't see that that's $100 to park. Oh, uh, it's crazy. Now. That's for Marina. That's for permit holders anyway. So let's check it out. We're going to check out the parking situation. We're going to check out the police presence. We're going to check out everything. We're going to basically tell you whether it's safe to Break come to Miami Beach 
If I can go out on the beach, I will. Brass tacks. I mean, there's a lot of like ifs, ands, or or maybe. If it's and butts were candy and nuts. Hudson says no bad people, just uh, just good pizza. Stuart if my Price Aunt is saying. Had a willy. Just did you hear what Stuart Price said? What. Hudson says no bad people, just good pizzas. Exactly. Oh, loving that. I love that. Ronnie C is hi and he's saying hi. Hey, Wilfredo Rosado is saying hi. How is Hudson? Welcome Every, aboard, everybody. Everybody is good. Brenda Nelson's in the chat. We're breaking this Patricia down. Patricia Romero, uh, Rogeri O is in the chat. Keith Havens, Joseph uh, Gian Grande. See, there's on street parking down there. That's oh. strange. But I think it's only for. Brenda residents. said she had problems with her internet in New Jersey, so. Who knows? Now, Maybe they're hacking again. Right. There appears to be on the street parking down here. Now, here's uh, Sweet yeah, Boy it's, Hudson. It's hard. It's residential over here. There's Sweet Boy Hudson on his new blanket. They might turn off the parking meters later. Right. So, I mean, a lot of the things that we heard about, first of all, like, we thought there was checkpoints just to get on Miami Beach from 395 even during the That's day. That's after 7 p.m. But apparently there is no checkpoint. I think it was all day last week. Right. Apparently not today because we just we just crossed over so let's keep on driving around we're by the expensive um condos now murano red restaurant uh joe St stone crab portofino on on the on the right coming up south point park run in and grab me a fish sandwich yeah i think it might i don't know special event zone what does that say all finds double special event zone okay Look at that. That That's, thing costs a pretty penny. I'll tell you that now. A pretty penny. Where, um, you know, with the uh, yeah. internets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Derek Dulce saying hi. CAKA13 saying hi. There you go. As and Boy is saying hi. We're driving. CAKA813 put up some uh, emojis for St. Patrick's Day. Tomorrow is St. Patrick's Day. Yep. So, guys, park, park. are number one. Okay. My excitement, I forgot all these things. Yeah, that's from I Ontario. Down, I have to do a U turn and go down Washington. Well, why don't we just go straight just to see if that parking lot is closed? You know how there's a parking oh, yeah, lot yeah, straight yeah. down the beach? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, guys, we, we have to dispel any myths that might be dissuading people from coming to Miami Beach uh, during spring break. One of them is that there's no on-street parking. Hmm. Or, you know, transmission is... Meh. Yeah, that's why I'm going to turn around now and go down Washington. See, people are pooling around there. It looks like you can still park down here. Right. Down there that you can't go. Guys... Right, so they had the road closed there. Guys, there, there is on-street parking. I mean, I it's... I think it... I don't know. Right, it's not, it's not what they said with the with the hundred dollars. Um, we don't know though. But that's a parking lot, so there is on street parking here that pay per parking. Yeah, I'm going up to Washington first. We'll go down there. Is that when they show it on the news? No, okay. now we're going to do um, on the way back down. Here. Right? We're going to go Collins that way and then come back Washington. It doesn't matter. The important thing is to stay, stay exactly. How's it doing now? Okay. Más o menos. That was better. But I'm gonna make the right. We'll see. I can always cut over to Collins Highway. You know, we'll go around the block. Welcome aboard, guys. Saturday night. You know that. Guys, so here we're here to check out Miami Beach. It's to, a pretty pretty thing here. I mean, Miami Beach is always a favorite of ours to visit. However. It's gotten a bad rap for spring break this year because of the problems that occurred last year. Now, we were here during my uh, spring yeah, break last it. year. We live streamed and we didn't see any problems whatsoever. But we didn't, we weren't out at four o'clock in the morning or, or after midnight for that matter, which is when I think all the problems are occurring. After midnight, you can let it all hang so out. So here's Joe Stone Crab. After midnight, they're not paying attention at all what's going on. I haven't had a um, chat in a while, so I might have, you know. Guys, let me know if you can hear me, because um, sometimes internet is spotty by Joe Stone Crab. We're just passing that by. I think the internet seems a little stronger now, so it should be okay. Let me know if you can hear me, number one.
because um, you know a, a lot of people have been dissuaded from coming to Miami Beach because of the um, the problems. Yeah, they try to you know they've been on the news, you know, and it. And it yeah, we lost the chat. So there's that. Guys, welcome aboard. We're on Washington now, heading north. Gu guys, it's Carla, South Beach. Carla Two Phones. Um, I'm reading the chat on my alternate phone. So I can I, I can hear you guys. I'm glad you can hear me. Thank you so much, Wilfredo Rosado. Damon Dodd says it's crystal clear. Thank you, guys. Yeah, so this is perfect. We stay on uh, Washington and we explore... Miami Beach. Now, we see if there's parking. We looked at. We will. We'll go drive by parking garages. We'll look at everything. Yeah. We're gonna find out the situation. Whether all these myths about the dangers of South Beach during spring break, meaning now, are true. Yeah, they're meaning true. Ellis ba Basley just sent us ninety nine and cents super chat. Thank Thanks, you Ellis. so much, Ellis. That is That's so a sweet of you. Fantastic job letting us know we're here. Let me show you, sweet boy There's Hudson. The Hudson. There's nice. Hudson. He's looking out the Find window. That very encouraging. Thanks for that, Ellis. Thank you, Ellis. Let me say hi to you too. I'm gonna South do my Florida. front camera. Hold on. Thank you, Ellis. Thank you so much. So sweet of you. Extra yep. good. Appreciate it, Ellis. Thanks for hanging, out, guys. We looked forward to this. Hanging out with you Saturday night. J and K. You know how that goes. And right now we're on South Beach. Sobe as the kids say, right honey? Exactly. Well, so, so Bob is saying hi. So guys, here we are on South of Fifth. Sobe. Now we're in South Beach. Now it's been in the news that South Beach has broken up with the spring breakers, meaning they've imposed so many restrictions, what are restrictions? that no one's coming to South Beach. We're here to find out if that's true. So far, it's right crowded. now, I see a lot of people. On, in, I haven't been to the beach yet, but we're gonna get to that. Don't worry, we're gonna get to that. They showed Joe um, Burgess is in the chat. Sharon De Pasquale. Hey, Joe. Hey, Sharon. Cynthia Orr saying we can hear you. Thank you. Thanks, Cynthia, for that. Thanks again, Ellis. Nice job. So guys, we're in South Beach. That's a fantastic Number job. one, I can tell you there is on-street parking, at least south of Fifth. Now we're crossing over Fifth Street. We're into the to the to the major zone where now, now they're saying no honking. There's signs up and I see police. <laughs> now, oh, they did hey, take look, away the parking the, here. Yeah, the parking's look, gone here. They did take away the parking on And on, on the other side. Right, both sides of the street. And I heard South of Fifth was just for residents. That's right. what I've heard. On Washington, there's no more street parking. So South of Fifth is street parking. But look at this, guys. They've taken away That's all, a lot of barricades. all the street parking here. Yeah. A lot of barricades. So no more street parking Here's here a couple of spring in breakers. South Beach. Here's, Here's a, a couple of spring breakers. Right, or they could be residents. Right, or employed. If you're employed here. You right. Know, if you live in South Beach, or you work in, so in South, South Beach. Beach, you can park in a garage, but there's no street parking. But They've again, taken it away. Last year we were here, everybody was well-behaved, polite. It was just a nice time. We weren't here at 4 a.m., though. Right. That's the difference. Right. See, there's the difference. So last year during spring break, That's the we, link line. we live streamed. You can watch our live streams. And we didn't have any problems. Sunset, a little bit after right. sunset, was everybody was now, you can Wait, going down the side streets, I don't see any, I don't notice parking spaces, but we'll keep on, we'll keep our eye out. This is, we're doing an exploratory drive first. First, we're going to explore and then we're going to decide. So no parking on the street. So, I mean, right Just off take the bat, one dip and end it. right out of the bat, I got to tell you that I mean, I'm a little concerned about small businesses. Yep, that's one thing we always keep in mind. Right, because you know, you know, we're big supporters of small businesses, and I hate to see small businesses suffer because there's no place to park. Now, what we have to do, one of our goals for today, is to check out and see if um, the garages are $100 to Hudson. park in. Right, that was Hudson groaning. Let me show you sweet boy Hudson. He's checking out the parking situation. Here he is. Here looks like some sort of enforcement officer right here. Yeah, see, it's a city. Yep, Miami Beach. Oh, Hudson. That's Miami Beach Parking Department is next to us. 
Hutch, I know Hutch. Hutch. Hutch, Hutch you need some his, water? Hutch finds the parking situation. Right. <laughs> that horrible. Right. He's saying Hudson's like, yeah, what? Hutch, let him look out the window. No pizza? Hutch. Hutch is going out the window. He's going to check it out. See what's going on here. Yeah, the, the sidewalks do look rather look, empty. The, the right turns to Collins look... Uh, Zazo Bob saying the... Oh, something going on down there. That the sidewalks look rather empty. And I, I would agree with you on that. So... Now, we are two blocks from the beach. Right. This isn't usually... Um, Try to see what's going on down Collins. There's the, there's the 11th Street Diner. That's the... the that was fine to turn down that one, but I think let's no, go a little further. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's explore. To Lincoln Road area. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go down. We're on Washington Avenue now. We're gonna check out the scene on Washington Avenue. Then we're gonna go down Collins and check out the scene there. Roll our sleeves up and check it out. Right. Look, they're building something new over there. Stephen Castro says, sad to say, we just lost a small business record shop that's been in business for 50 years where he is. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah, that's we don't like to, to hear. hear that at all. No, that's not good news. Honey, look at how it's just sacking out. No, no. What? No, I'm trying to put it down. It won't go There's down a, any oh, further. Oh, it won't go down any further. That's Guys. Nice. Hudson. Hudson's trying to look out the window, but in our rental car that we have, the windows are... There's a down. safety window, safety feature. They don't go down all the way. Yeah. So let me um, put back. He's trying to put his head out, you know, the best he can. So guys, as you can see, they took away all the on-street parking away here in uh, South Beach. There's barricades up where there used to be on-street parking where you could pay for Park Mobile. They've taken yeah, they that closed away. closed outdoor restaurant, supposedly. Right. There's the Club Deuce. Oh, we you got a there's a, a vintage car. We have to take a photo with a real camera. Okay. How am I gonna stop there? It, it's just a it's it's a fabulous shot. Okay. You want me to go around the block? I would. Okay. I would chance it. Then. Sure. Um, sure. Yeah, we're right across from Espanola Way. I'll take it right here. Yeah. Do you want to climb in back and get the full camera out? Yeah, because it's going to be now. one of those things. No, no, it'll, it'll, I'll pull down the alley, maybe. You can always go around twice. I like seeing this. So. Yeah, guys, I spotted a vintage car, but I can, I can get out and just. Why don't? Let me just get it on my lap. Yeah, but the light's going to change, so. Grab the backpack. Yeah, I know. Honey. Hey guys. South Beach Saturday night, you know that. A little different because of spring break. They took away all the parking on this street. Uh, parking garages allegedly are $100 to park. Right. So, guys. Parking meters have been shut off, I thought. We are, we are taking a small detour. See how you can always pull up onto these, and then I can run back. Yeah, even you right now. Over here? Yeah, I can go down this alley. Okay. But you're going to have to just... You, will you mind um, mining the chat for a second? Oh, no, no. If I, well, yeah. If I have to, I'll come around and get you. I'll be circling around this block if they make me move. Well, how are you going to do that in live stream? Well, I'm just going to hold just, it. Yeah, I would just put on your blinkers. Okay. There we go. Hey, guys, okay. welcome hold, aboard. Hold on, guys. Vincent Padula popping in. Hey, Marty. I mean, I can take that and try to hold it at the I same would. time. Yeah, they're going to like that. Okay, guys. And I'll keep circling if I have to. All Here, right. take this. Once you get out. Remember, you have a, f a phone. Yeah. I'm leaving w you with the phone. Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm getting out. James is going to stay here for a second. Okay. So I'm going to meet you back here no matter what. Okay. Okay. So, guys, unscheduled detour. You're going to understand why I'm doing this. This is super important. I am running. I am running down the street. The reason I'm running is I saw an amazing car parked in front of Club Deuce and I have to show it to you. It's a vintage car. It is an amazing photograph and I am going to get it. So I am running down the street to go back to Club Deuce just to get this photo. I'm running now. 
you know how Kami Carla is. Guys, wait till you see this, this photo. And then you're gonna understand why I'm doing this. Now, sorry that I'm not reading the chats. I'm getting the camera prepared because the car could pull out any second. Trust me, this is gonna be worth it, guys. Okay, here it is. Look at this, guys. Look at this car. Look at that, guys. Look at that Bel Air, guys. Okay, guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait a second. Look at this amazing car. Look at that. Okay, here we go. Now I can get it. Okay, guys, now I'm gonna look at the car more. Look at this Bel Air. This is amazing. Oh my God. Look at that. How awesome is this Bel Air? Guys, it's a 1957 Bel Air. I just checked, you know my secret. Okay. We're gonna get, we're gonna take another photo of it. Guys, sorry I'm not uh, reading the chats. Okay, guys, it's just such an amazing car. How can I not get this? Look at this 1957. This is why, this is, that is a, the reason why I had James pull over. Yeah, it's a 1957. I'm just waiting to take another photo once this um, uh, person gets out of my photograph.
Okay, guys, I'm pretty satisfied I got the photo that I need, but I'm gonna go in the shade and check it out. Yeah, I got the photo. I got the photo. We got it. Guys, we got the photo. This was well worth it. Well worth it. I mean, the car is a beauty. It's a 1957 Chevy Bel Air, and it's amazing. Now, I might as well show you Club Deuce. This is Club Deuce. I'm sure the owner of the car is probably in here. Uh, they, they must be in here. This is the iconic Club Deuce, and I'm sure that the owner of the car is somewhere in this bar. I don't know where they are, but it's an amazing bar. It's the OG bar. great okay so I better go back to James because he's gonna be like what is she doing all right so I'm gonna go um, I'm actually not gonna go down the alley let's w let's walk down the street instead so let's say goodbye to Club Deuce oh you know what I want to get one more photo <laughs> guys be patient with me we're gonna get another photo Guys, we're gonna get another photo. Be, be patient with me. Okay. Good. Couldn't be better. All right, so let's go back to James. Hopefully he's gonna find me. I'm not gonna run, I'm gonna be calm. I am just so happy. That was a beautiful photo of the iconic Club Deuce on 14th Street here in South Beach with a 1957 Chevy Bel Air. How can you go wrong? Woo! I mean, honestly, my day is complete. My day is complete. Can't be better. As you can see, and we're going to drive along this with James Collins. Um, there's, there's not that many people. Um, it seems like people are heeding the warnings and, and staying away. Dennis, wh what are we doing with all these photos? Dennis, we have nine books on the subject of small businesses in New York. And we're going to, um, and, and or graffiti. We're going to keep these photos. We sell them too. And, um, you know, who knows? Maybe we'll do a book on South Beach uh, one day. I mean, basically, James and I, we collect a lot of photos. And then maybe we make them into a book. Maybe we just sell the prints. But we're photographers, so uh, what we do with all the photos, we keep them. We keep them. That's, uh, we have a huge collection of photos. Look at this, guys. There's no traffic. I can just basically walk out on the street. Yeah, so I mean, I could sell that photo. Um, you know, that what that isn't why we take it. We take it because we love it. We love small businesses. We love Club Deuce. It's an iconic, original, family-owned small business. It's really, the, I think it's the oldest bar. Hey, how are you? 
having fun? Yeah. See, there's no problems here. I don't know why they make a big fuss about it. It's no problems. We've been having a beautiful time. What? I mean, in all. Miami. What did you say? Like in a way, it's almost good that now it's empty. You got the whole place to yourself, right? Yeah. <sighs> Where are you guys here from? We're from Flint. Oh, wow. Now you had a cold winter, right? Oh yeah. So, so I, it's all year round down there now. Now, now you're beautiful. Now you're living oh, living oh, la vida yeah. loca. Oh, have fun. Oh, uh, see, no drama. They're having fun. Oh, this is fabulous. All right, so let's get back to James and Hudson, who's been waiting patiently. Wait till because he, he didn't even see the Chevy Bel Air. He has no idea why I got out of the car to take this photo. He has no idea. And look at this, there's hardly anybody on the street here, but everyone is enjoying themselves. There's no there's no drama. No, no drama at all. Right? You guys are enjoying yourselves. See, no problems, right? I don't know why they say you know, I think they're giving giving South Beach a bad rap. Okay, so here's James. James? You saw it? Look here, sweet boy Hudson. Okay, you saw it? Yeah, I was watching the whole thing. Oh, awesome. Yeah, Check out. Fantastic. Hold on, before we. What's that? Oh, thank you. He's watching out for us. Nice. Extra good. Thank you. You got your reading glasses on still? Wait till I got you, them right here. All right, wait till you see the photo. Back back up and, and look at check out the yeah, photo. Yeah, red, so I'm good. James is now understanding why I got out to get this photo. 1957 yeah, mint looks beautiful. Chevy Bel Air. I yeah. took like a thousand of them. Yeah, no, it's perfect, too. <laughs> perfect. I know one of them is going to work well because oh, yeah. I waited for the co no yeah, car. Guys, I waited for no person. For a lot of different reasons. Yeah, I was I was patient. One oh, of the look at that. one defender of the defender in that color. I've never seen it. That is a nice defender. One of the best rules. Look at that, guys. I don't know if you can see that. One of the best rules of photography, if you're going to do street photography, which is definitely what I would call this, is to be patient. Be patient, be. and it will work out for you. Patient. Now, we weren't originally going to make a right on Collins. We we're, were going to go around the thing. But, I'm going to go down farther on Washington. Right. We're going to just spin around. We're going to go back on Washington, Past go a little further. Beach. We're going to see whether the... Oh, there's a parking garage open 24 hours. Do you see a sign that says $100? $100. No, I don't. I don't see a sign, but I'll look out for it now. I'm so excited. Khaled Muhammad said greetings from Egypt. Hey, Egypt. That 57 Chevy Bel Air convertible is in mint, in that condition is worth seventy five to eighty thousand dollars. Uh, Brenda Nelson looked it up. Lawrence. It was in beautiful. It was mint condition. Look at James. these parking things here. Lawrence so guys, of Arabia. we are now on Collins Avenue. Now he came to fight the turkey. There's not that many people, as you can see. Are you going to go down the street so you can see it? Yeah, of course. Oh, we're going to see the whole reason yet again why I had James turn and stop. It's just so I could get this photo, and I'm so glad we did. I like that color of that uh, Land Yeah, Rover. that's working for me. Avocado. Fifi, Fifi Lee also likes doing street photography. CIK says, I always wait for no traffic and people when I'm taking pictures. I'm very particular. So are we. I mean, oh, there it goes. Oh, my God. I got it uh, just in, in time. Should we follow it? Just in time, it? no. Okay. Guys, I got that. That's kismet. That, see, now another rule of thumb for street photography is when you see the photo, you better take it right away because here, to, here today, gone tomorrow is the saying. And basically, if I had waited and I hadn't gotten out of the car and literally run down that alley to get that shot, they would have left. They would have been gone. They would have been gone. And now they're gone. Here today, gone tomorrow. That means that I can get a I can get a photo of Club Deuce without any cars. And look at this Maserati, this Lamborghini. James, would you be interested in that? Because now no. there's no cars in front no. of it. I that's, like with the car. That's the shot, right? Yeah. yeah, I thought so too. Hey, look at this. Uh, look at that, the Impala. 
I don't think anybody cares the about SS Impala. No, look no, at no one Chevy. cares about the Impala SS compared no, to that those, Chevy Bel Air. That's one of the last full size SS. All right, all right. It's a super sport. He's excited yeah. about it. I love all. I'm so, so we have the Lamborghini, the 57 Chevy on this block. Lot of lot says, thing. "Wow, you catch it. Face red heart shape." Yeah, I locked out. Now. That is the reason, number one, we always carry around our professional camera. That isn't even our best professional camera. This is like our mid-range. Second string. It's our mid-range professional our, camera. It's our junior varsity. Yeah. JV. Brendan Nelson says, Kami Carla got her shot. Perry Wilk says, it's hard to find all the areas in Miami. Thank goodness for South Beach. Yeah. Guys, so number, a number two rule in street photography. Number one rule is when you see, when you see a photo, take it number two rule is be patient be patient and wait for like no traffic wait for no people in front of your shot if that's what you desire if you want people if you want cars and ball blocking your your photograph that's fine you know take it as you will but we prefer not mr funkman says i wish i could have this cup but when here in glasgow it's raining and miserable oh man this is the exact opposite yeah Dennis Reynolds says, would you be this excited if you saw my Honda Civic? Probably not. So if it's an uh, R, but, Type R. But if it's a Type R, I probably would. Yeah. Those things are crazy. Now, as you can see, let's, I got to calm Spignola. down. Washington the Avenue, up. right. Yeah. There's hardly any people walking. Well, it's barricaded too. Well, no, 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 no. Besides the no parking on the street, there's hardly anybody walking. Usually this street would be way more crowded on a Saturday. We can all agree on that, right, James? Okay. Way more crowded on Saturday. Now, let me show you. Sweet Boy Hudson is trying to look out the window, but in this rental car, you know, we, he has a limited view. Yeah. Sharon De Pasquale says, my parents always owned an Impala. Oh, extra good. Look at this new artwork, that's new. Look, it looks like Jackie Gleason, Muhammad Ali. Yeah, Brenda, I know that. The SS stands for Super Sport. Yeah, Super Sport. You know it. Because she James says it means a lot of power. And I know actually what it's it means Super Sport because uh, a friend of mine nice job, had Brenda. a Monte Carlo SS, the yep. Monte Carlo Super Sport. Yep. I had a 72, 70 Monte Carlo. And, uh, it wasn't a Super Sport, but it was powerful. as all get out. Oh, hey, Daryl Jennings saying good afternoon. James oh, and Carla, too, from Chicago. Tesla. Oh, he's not. He's not around? Nick G, if you watch this on replay, um, we're using your water uh, Tesla water mug. Yep. Thank you. It fits right into the area here. God, we haven't seen this. Current temperature, Zazo Bob, is actually, according to our car thermometer, 84, 84 degrees Fahrenheit. Marion just became a member. Oh, Marion. Is that Auntie Marion? Thank you so much. Let me show you, sweet boy Hudson. Haggis. James, do you need your sunnies? Haggis. Yes. Auntie Marion cooking up some haggis. CIK813 says my parents owned an Impala too. They also owned a Chevy Biscayne. Oh, and, we're, and you know, hey, that's just so Florida, Biscayne Boulevard, that right? They're taking some pictures. Well, why not? Yeah. Oh, this is, this is, I, I mean, to me, my day is complete already. Yeah. Just getting that photo has made my day, yeah. I mean, Happy, happy. My Sassy, word. sassy, playful, playful. Mr. Funk Fan says, glad you're sh uh, streaming. You're cheering me up. I pulled a uh, muscle in my back and oh, I'm in pain. That sucks. Oh, let your pain just melt away. Melt away in the Melt away in the South tropical sun. tropical sun. Here's Mr. Hudson. Happy, happy. Here you go, Mr. Funk Fan. Sassy, band. sassy, playful, playful. There you go. There's you a know sweet... how we do it, guys. Playful Maybe you want to close the windows to st keep the sassy air conditioner gym. in here. Sassy. Me and my ex owned a blue Impala. It was beyond fast, says Mima Flowers. Oh, nice. Vincent Padula misses his Hellcat. Oh, yeah, you better. I would, yeah. I'm still car hunting. I can't find anything I like, says Vincent Padula. Liberty Tree says those 90s Impalas are really nice. Yeah, I love them. Um, Ellis ba Bowsley, any outdoor parking lots? Apparently, the parking lots are now charging $100 to park in south South Beach. Of, south of 17th, I think. Right, so we're going we're gonna to find out about that. Right now, they took away all the on-street parking. You know, this is, we're giving you, we're laying it down for you exactly. Wednesday, 11 p.m. to Monday, 3 a.m. That's what it says right here, no parking. Tollway zone. Well, that's... No, that's not always there. See, that's right. Wednesday, 11 p.m. to Monday, 3, 5 a.m. Right. So, we're no... We're in the wrong lane here. 
Right. But that's okay because we're... We're checking it all out. But if you want to get in the left because this is all people no, trying to turn, Yeah, I well, think. we're going to turn eventually. Uh, the next block after this one. So we'll just stay here. After Lincoln Road, Look at right? We see everybody walking around. And Maybe around at, Lincoln Road. Not many Road. takers here. No. There's, at this restaurant. I mean, see, I feel bad for them. I feel bad for the small businesses because even... I've been busy. I could tell at Max Club Deuce... That it was it wasn't outside. it wasn't very busy. No, it didn't look crowded. I took one interior photo, but it really needs tripod because yeah, it's dark in here. It was up to sixty four hundred. I saw four hours a day. It's dark. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. C A K eight one three. The parking lot said they are charge. The parking garage says they're charging a hundred dollars. I see a sign that says ten dollars parking. Do you mm -hmm. see that? Yeah. But I don't know if that's just for a half hour. Right. Now we are in a rental car, so we have to be careful. We don't want to get, um, you know, tapped or rear-ended or anything like that. I mean, not that we ever want to have that happen to us, but you know, we want to be particularly careful now. There goes some people. They look like they're spring breakers. They could be. Yeah. So ten dollars for parking at every every hour. Oh, he's really running. Looks like he knows what he's doing. L, the original checking in. Hey, L. L, the original just became a YouTube member. Nice oh job, Oh, my L. God. Thank you so much, L, the original. Oh, and Vincent Fadula just sent us 1999 super sticker. Uh, oh, my Vincent God. Fadula, thank nice you job. so much, Vincent. Let me say hi to you and, Thanks, and show you, you sweet Thanks boy. Thanks, so Vincent. Hi, Vincent. Here's, Here's the Hudster. Here we are. Me and Huds. Thank you, Vincent. Thank you, Vincent. Nice job, guys. Thank you. Fantastic job. L, the original, just be, uh, became a member. It's putting up all the Hudson emojis. Extra nice job. good. We and Marion says, hi, James and Carla in the chat. Hope everything is good. Marion, we hope you're doing well. And here's a little boop. This is for Marion, just for Marion, Re really for everybody else. Marion, here's a boop cam. Boop. Guys, we're in the thick of this down here. I got to tell you that. Now. Here's Lincoln Road. Now, Lincoln Road is the iconic um, shopping uh, pedestrian area designed by none other than Morris Lapidus. Yeah. He's a famous designer. Yeah, let's go a little, um, and then we'll make the right right here before, you yeah, know, that laugh it up, before that internet uh, no-go zone. That's a great job, Vincent. Thank you. Thank you, Vincent. Now, right here is the Miami Beach at the Jackie Gleason Theater, the Fillmore. So it's a, a convention center. It's a, a performing uh, center and also the famous uh, historic Temple Emanuel. Now 17th Street, this is where, south of this, this is where all the, the restrictions take off. Exactly, because one block further is the Miami Convention Center. Right, that typically doesn't fall under these uh, extra restrictions. <gasps> Ellie Original is gonna be sending some baby Hudson. Baby Hudson, Baby who's going to be 12 years old. Baby Hudson. Sandwich cookies very soon. Oh, oh L, the original. It. You know he he's going to love those. Keep them away from Jim. Mm. Guys, so we just made a turn from Washington Avenue. And look at this, James Avenue. Yeah, we oh, yeah, James this is that pretty, um, pretty hotel, hotel is on right? the right. Yeah. yeah, look at it down in there. The James Hotel. Yeah. Now, we are going to be turning and showing you the situation on Collins now. on Collins Avenue now that's also aka a1a that's also known <gasps> as a1a Liberty Tree just woke up a few days ago and saw a giant tent on my car can't even open the door now oh my oh, god god that's that horrible. happened in New York City she said a Liberty Tree says I hate living in New York City I can't wait to get out of here and move to Charleston oh to nice. South Carolina yeah we, love yeah we were very lucky that we found the driver of the car who dented our car while parked um, I, 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 we feel for you, Liberty Tree. So now we're going to make a right on Collins. Marion says those blue skies are beautiful. Marion, we hope this video transports you to the gorgeous Miami Beach, which despite all the negativity that's been in the news, it's been fine. So it's been beautiful. Yeah. Haggis. But it's really kept, um, people away. Oh, look at all those cars outside that SLS hotel. Oh yeah. See, they're redoing this one, the Delano. Guys, this is the famous Delano, and, they, and it's been closed. It's a hotel that's been closed 
um, really since the pandemic, and they're re redoing it now. Classic car spotting Carla makes a pleasant change. Exactly, says uh, uh, Ivor George. Yeah, to see a mint condition Chevy 57. Is that Ivor this... George? Yes, Ivor, yes. Ivor City. It's Trey Speedy. But that's IV. This is IV. I Ivor, gotcha. Right. Hey, there's a Bentley. Batania. Florida's funniest flamingo. No, I mean, I honestly, I think that a lot of the bad things that happened in Miami Beach in the past during spring break happened late at night. And if you come here like now during the day, there seems to be no problems. I it mean, we were we were here last year, and honestly, there was no problems either. And but we could just park we were here we were during the day and into the early evening. You know, we weren't here past midnight ever. So you know, as much as we can say from our own it personal knowledge. Right, that belongs to the Gale Hotel. The police are doing a good job. Dennis Reynolds says, Gifts gave us $10. You guys are hyped today. Dennis, fantastic. Dennis, let me show you, sweet boy, and me. Thank you, Dennis. Thank, Dennis, thank you so much. Fantastic job. Show the car lurking in the weeds. Oh, look at this. Look. Honey, show that car right now. I, I got real. I got to get. In the look at this. Look at this vintage car here. Look at that Mercedes. Whoa. Outside Hotel Gale. Okay, so guys, here we are on Collins Avenue. Now, we are we are here to check out the scene in Miami Beach because yeah, brass tacks. There's been a lot of negative connotations. Oh, well, uh, James, that's a little Lamborghini SUV. If you want to pull forward so people can see it, yeah, I see. It. Guys, this is a very expensive SUV in front of us, the Lamborghini from Illinois. Illinois plates. Look, you're having your cocktail out here. Serving Spanish tradition since 1894, yeah. this place. So Holy there's God. hardly any um, crowds here um, for spring break. And, and, and I mean, that's good in that the, the police are keeping the peace and everybody's staying safe. But at the same time, I do feel for, for small businesses they that, say to her. that spring break is their make or break it time. Because this is the peak it's of like tourist season. Friday. And nice money during last. spring break, then you know that hurts their bottom line. So that's our concern. You know, you have to find like a happy medium between the two. That's your in, bottom dollar. In my in my opinion, for what it's worth. Yep. But here we are, Collins Avenue. Let's check out the scene during spring break 2024. Everything seems very quiet, very safe. Yep. The mighty bull says spreading more good luck to all. Yeah, this isn't really safe what he's doing. No, I, he, he took me by surprise. Right. Usually. I don't think you should cross in the middle of the street well, you know, against the probably, traffic. Probably not. Now, this is the Lowe's. This is a, a very beautiful We're hotel. We're going to drive back north up here, too. Right. Why not? Look at now, tropics. look at these gorgeous Art Deco. Oh, there's a Malambo. Orange. You can rent it. Yep. This is the Parisian Hotel. We photographed all of these. They're looking extra good. This is where you can rent some exotic cars. Hudson just thought he saw pizza in Carla's ear. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, that's pretty. Hey, I've heard a broccoli ear, you know, like a fighter gets. Yeah, broccoli. Now look, $50. Parking, $50. P50. Wow. $50 at this parking lot. I thought guys. it was 100 No, they, they reduced it. Yeah, not many takers. There's a, there's a. Oh, look at they're they're lining up. They're lining up to pay $50. Wait a minute. Should I get out and find out if that's truly $50? We'll be going That's back. what it says, $50. Yep. Hey, look, he's got your shirt on. I know. Yeah, a few bad apples, exactly. Um, causing trouble, the majority just having fun. That's what I Mr. said. Mr. Funkman, we couldn't Mr. agree Mr. with Funkman, you. Look at I that said, Chewbacca on their car. I said 98% of the kids are just having fun. Right. It's the 2% that wreck it. You gotta be knuckleheads. Right. Maybe they're staying at the Z Ocean Hotel and, the, and it's a reduced rate if you're a hotel guest. Yeah, you get guest. a voucher. Yes. There's an officer right there. You Bunker uh, 156 Roma says, Pizza e bueno. Yeah, but I don't want to bother him. He's, you know, he's busy, James. Yeah, he's got his uh, neckerchief on. So, 
So wow, that was so lucky to capture um, that uh, Club 57 uh, I Chevy can't wait Bel Air. To, to process that, pump it up. Yeah, Miss, Mr. Funkman and Asin Boy can't believe it cost fifty dollars to park your car at that yeah, lot. Yeah, that's insane. Down that here, that's too. a lot of money. And we heard that there's ones that are a hundred dollars. It's the funk phenomena. It's the funk phenomena. Look, see that valet parking over yeah. here. Yeah, Miami Egypt, where a beach is a place where people can be uh, someone they're not and, and, and rent an expensive car. That's true. Just like true. New York, kind of. Yeah. Just go to be someone else. CAK813 says, that's always the way it is, that a few people spoil things for the majority. Yeah, I mean, I, I you know, we're very positive people, but I have to agree with you on that statement. Every, every kid and every young adult we've met here has been awesome. Yeah. That's our experience. And everyone... Um, but again, we're not out at 4 a.m. Right. Everyone that we met in the daytime and early evening on Fort Lauderdale Beach that That's we awesome. interviewed They're too fine. for College spring kids. break. Yeah. And they even shouted out to their parents, a bunch of them. Parents that watch our channel. It, you know, one, of, one of the kids, it's like, she like told they, me that her mother bought her the tickets to come to Spring That's Break. why they have to close Washington Square Park now, yeah. because of the couple knuckleheads. Yeah. They can't just have fun. they got to wreck things yeah. for everybody. Yeah, so you see, they took away the on-street parking here. Guys, it used to be a park mobile app where you'd pay like $4 an hour to park your cars. And they took that away to dissuade people from coming down to uh, spring break here in uh, now, South Beach. Now, you might say, well, this is causing a wreck on Collins. No, Collins is always like this. Right. Tranquilo, James. There's Tranquilo. Yeah, I know. I'm getting pumped up. So, so far... Get a little saucy. It's, it's been safe. However, there's hardly anybody here. Hardly anybody. Because of the huge police presence, because of all the restrictions of parking and, uh, you know, the checkpoints that they're going to happen at night. Curfew. Just the word curfew, you know, discourages a lot of people. Right, because, you know, people that are, uh, that are going to be respectful that want to go out past midnight and go um, have a drink at a bar. Now they can't. Right. Wow, Vikingson says there's a snowstorm here in Stockholm, Sweden. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Skull. Vikingson. Skull. Oh, look at this. Look wow, at that. Wow, look at that. Mustang. Look at that Mustang. Holy oh my God. Crap. It, a 5.0. Wow. That has a lot of ground stripes effects on there, yeah. With those racing stripes, and extra good. And a lot of the arrow, arrow effects on it. Oh, no, that was amazing, right? Passing by Hotel Clifton, guys. Marion just sent us four ninety nine dollars Saturday tree for Hudson from Auntie Marion. Auntie oh, Marion. Oh, let me show you, sweet boy. Um, it, sweet boy Hudson. Hudson, Auntie Marion just sent you a treat. He says, thank you, Auntie Marion. Here's a police officer making sure everyone's safe. Yeah. Thank you, Auntie Mary, and appreciate it. So sweet of you. Vincent uh, rented a Ferrari, a uh, Testarossa, when he was in spring oh, break. Oh. Vincent. Vroom, 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 right? Yeah, yeah. Vroom, vroom, vroom. He's now, balling. look at that. No, nobody eating at Ristorante Italiano. That's what I feel badly for, is that crowded. these restaurants, this would, this would be their money-making season. And now no one's here. There's the maitre d' just standing outside, staring out into space. Hey, Justine, saying hello, James and Carl, and Hudson Nova. Oh, my God. What Hudson a Nova. Hudson Nova. Guys, if you haven't... If you, if you watched our live stream on hey, Wednesday... Ladies. Hudson got so much attention uh, from the girls the ladies. and men, yeah, both the girls ladies. and boys, yeah, you know. ladies and men, Not during Fort Lauderdale Walk, uh, spring break, Fort Lauderdale Beach on Wednesday. You got to watch that live stream just to watch how many people petted Hudson. Hey, it know, was an insane a, amount. This is a serious car in front of us, the Jaguar XFS. Yeah, that's true. It's an S-type. Yeah, I see yeah, that. That's a serious car right there. Yeah, they took away all this business. Um, yeah, Vincent Perdue says the mayor wanted this. He said on the news when they interviewed him that he didn't care if they didn't come. Yeah, I mean, that's easy for him to say because he doesn't own, <laughs> he doesn't own a small Italian restaurant on Collins Avenue. Right. And this is the, now, the time of year where you make your bucks. See, look at this. There's no one, there's no one eating here. Usually there would, there's one person sitting there with like, like just basically a cup of coffee. Yeah. This is 
is it. Look, love on the scooter. Love on the scooter, you know, like love wow, on the rocks. she's giving to him a talking to. She's schooling him. Yeah. Hey, look at the Corvette. That's a nice color. Where's J-Lo? Exactly, Robert, Robert Henderson. Pitbull. SS stands for Stephanie Stearns. Stephanie. Nice. Stephanie hey. Stearns. Stephanie, as I you can see, this. we're in Ken. South Beach, but um, because of the restrictions, the stringent restrictions put in place, no parking on the street, uh, curfew in effect at midnight, there's hardly anybody walking around. Now, well, this we'll block, Collins Avenue, would be packed, packed. would be packed with people walking. Jim, and there's, tooth there's to like jowl. basically. Um, back to back, belly to belly. Very few people. Very few people. All the way to the wall. Yeah. Look, see, they're saying what's Vincent going on. agrees that small businesses are suffering just because of, you know, a few uh, knuckleheads. Exactly. I don't know why you can't. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh oh. Does he not see that guy? What's wrong with him? I don't know him? why you can't come down here and just have fun. Why you'd have to run? Well, you know how it is, James. There's yeah. always. There's always. Uh, Everybody. All the kids we met in Fort Lauderdale. It was like actually. Fort Lauderdale felt wholesome. Oh, Southern Gal says, what happened to your car? Southern Gal, you'll have to watch the live stream where Nick G, um, our channel moderator, who uh, was visiting and uh, we spent the afternoon with, we took him out to lunch at La Tub in Hollywood Beach. While we were eating at the restaurant, our car got, our car got rear-ended. Rear-ended. Not rear-ended. I mean, uh, I got I got hit while I was in the parking well, lot. Another person the, the, rear-ended. Right. <laughs> another the, person with their rear end back right. into it. The front fender got damaged, mm -hmm. and it's been in the shop for um, almost two weeks now, and it's going to be two weeks. It's probably going to be at least another week. You two know, weeks. we've been getting updates that they had to order. Oh, they McLaren. had to order parts. Oh, McLaren. look at that McLaren. And then what's oh. that Corvette parked in front of? Look at that, that McLaren, thing is guys. Nice. That's a nice one. Oh, I love it. White. But that's parked on the street. Yeah. Because well, that must you know, be valet, you know? You know, that's... Exactly. If you have a McLaren, you know. Yeah, yeah exactly. Oh, no, no, you go ahead. You, you do what you want. You go ahead. G-Wagon, Porsche Panamera. Now, normally, now this this Here, is I'm another... Here, i put the window down to yeah. show how the what? noise. Or let me pull it up. Yeah, AC. Look at a rubber ducky in there. Look at this. Usually there would be tons of people at Sola. And Rubber I mean, there's a sum, but not as You're much as there you would normally be. You make my back. So, guys, so this has fun. really impacted. Um, you know, that's what I'm fearful of is that, you know, these small businesses suffer. I don't want to see any small business um, go out of business because Rubber of regulations. You know, that's just tough. It's, it's, a it's a tough balance. It's a tough balance. You know, What's safety versus. Um, oh, watch out! Watch What's out! Doing? It's a sanitation. I think doing? he might be. Oh, he's saying go ahead. Okay, good. Yeah, good that you waited. You know, you got to yeah, be God safe. Bless. He's got to keep it clean here. Appreciate you. Dennis Reynolds says they're, they're running up the bill on you. Yeah, well, thank God we're not paying for it. It's the other guy's um, insurance. Or else I'd be there every day. Yeah. With my arms folded. Right. Otherwise, we'd be like, Watching what, them. what's taking so long? I mean, you, was, know, uh, you know, we'd rather the repair get done properly than bother them. And the other person's insurance is paying for us to be in this rental car. So, you know. Rubber ducky. You know, at least we got that. See, now this road is closed. That right. one. This street, they totally closed. Totally closed that one. Right. So some streets, they, they took away the on-street parking, as you can see. Guys, we're... Yeah, we're passing the Chesterfield. If you're just joining us, I'm Iron, Carla. Iron Next to me is James. Iron. In the back seat is hey Hudson. Now. We're driving along Collins Avenue in Miami Beach because we want to check on um, how things are going for, for South Beach. We're in South Beach, the heart of South Beach. Baba Booey. Because of all the restrictions put in place. Can you drive along the beach? Mark, that road is closed. No, Mark. The answer is no, Mark. The road is closed. If you're on a bicycle, you can. Yeah. You're but bicycle, Mark, you're not allowed to drive along the beach. That road is closed. Yeah. It closes south of uh, 13th, I think, Mark. It closes uh, we're on from, Street from right 5th now. Street to around to 13th. Uh, no, no, past 14th. Past Lincoln yeah, Road. Yeah, maybe the 17th, I think, yeah. Mm -hmm.
let the body shop take their time so it comes out right. Exactly, Vincent. We haven't we haven't even called them once. Oh, there's a well, was that a Ferrari or a Lamborghini? Lambo. Oh, look, he put the wide extra wide fenders on. Yeah, that was sick. That was a wide body. Oh, Mark, Cigarette. we're in South Beach right now. We're not in North Miami Beach. You might be able to uh, drive along A1A in North Beach, probably. Yeah, we're up there, yeah. we'll, we'll probably head up that way, but right now we're in South Beach. See, road closed, Mark. Road closed. Yeah, it's <clears> a party out there. All the signs say road closed, Mark. But they've closed oh, look, there's the a big Bentley. Yeah, Bentania. Mm -hmm. The SUV. Carla's losing her voice. Getting pumped up. <clears throat> Oh, another SUV, a um, Aston Martin SUV. Wow. Yeah, it's crazy out here. Look at this now. This is all empty here. Right. So you can see business is really suffering down on this end. <clears throat> They're driving their little golf carts all over the place. Up, down, speeding all over. The investigator says, hey, let's help all chip in and pay for them to pay for $100 for parking. Oh, God. No, you know, don't waste your money on it. It's... Yeah, guys, we're going we're gonna to see um, what we can do. I'm going to try to get out to the beach, but, um, you know, I don't even want to encourage you to give us money to just throw look, away for $100 parking. they stopped making that car almost immediately. Yeah, see, Mark. No, look at the Murano convertible. See how it's the street guys, is Guys, this is there. a car you're never going to see. A uh, uh, Nissan Murano convertible. They stopped making it after like oh, 300 yeah. of them. Well, it's not doing too well. That's why. Look at it. No. The convertible yeah, no one is all it. broken. It was just well, a look fiasco. at it. It malfunctioned. No, it was a fiasco. Oh, they want us to show Hudson. Gerald, R, I will show you Hudson in, in a split second. Hold on. Here's sweet boy Hudson. There he is. Ron on so, location, just sent us $9.99. Hi, JKH. Thanks, Great shots. I like that car. I'd be worried about someone scratching it. Sorry I haven't been in the chat. I've been working a lot. Oh, hey, Ron, Ron on location. Thanks so much. Welcome Thank you, Ron. Aboard. Appreciate it. Extra, extra Big good. Up to Ron. No worries about you working. We, we know that you're busy. Honey, I'm going to go down left town. And then I'm going to go left, go down that, and then come back home. And we'll head up north. So I'm going to go left here, down ocean. Past, uh, oh, down ocean. Okay, yeah. not take this and then turn around and up No, because the traffic was terrible going up. Ocean. Perfect. I saw it. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to see if I can make Agreed. a left and a left. A Guys, left and a right. so we're going to head as close as we come back up Collins. We're going to head along um, Ocean Drive uh, south of 5th, which where where we, we believe we can drive. Okay, Mark? Atlantic Ocean. Kirk says the uh, Hudster looked very relaxed. He's loving Oh, April L. says, how long is spring break? That depends on the particular college that you go to, but spring break is usually refer referring to colleges, and different colleges have spring break at different times. Usually it's only one week long, but spring break pretty much lasts like almost the whole month of March because different colleges have spring break at different times. Right. But for the most part, this particular Some week people, and yeah. last week were the most popular weeks for colleges like to hold their spring break time. Now, remember that um, Easter Sunday is early this year. It's actually um, the last weekend of March. People getting in their car, in their Uber, Uma Oprah. Yeah, so this um, Murano really that's not it's and the light it's, red, it's so not yeah. it's not functioning properly, James. Yeah, no. You'll never see that car. That was one of the ones that, that was a big financial problem. Hey Bighorn MT is saying hi. Bighorn MT. Oh, Joe's, Joe Burgess, he loves laying on his new blanket. This is a blanket that he got for his 12th birthday from our wonderful channel supporter, Carolyn M. Um, we will be premiering that video this week. It is now available if you're a YouTube member and a Patreon member at the $4.99 and above level. 
you have access, early access to our uh, recorded videos and that is available uh, right now in case you want to watch it. Mark, we're doing great. It's fantastic. Welcome it's aboard, 84 Mark. degrees Fahrenheit, says the car thermometer here in Miami Beach. We are in ship shape. It's uh, spring break time, but the crowds have been avoiding Miami Beach because of the huge restrictions that the authorities have placed. Yeah, Kirk says mo mo most of the major colleges here in Michigan, spring break is already over. Yeah, that's what I said last week, I think, was the peak week. Oh, look at that bike. Oh, look at that. That's an OG bike. Yeah. He's loving life right now on that bike. I'm just loving this photo that I got. I'm just so... I'm, yep. Aren't you glad that I got out? I said, let me get out. I not let, let, Don't even waste, don't even waste no. your time going around the no, block. because it'll be gone. It left. I know. It pulled I, right out. I know. Mr. King of Florida says, how is Hudson? Oh, he's doing great. Let me show he's you. He's living him. his best life here. He's, he's asleep, guys. He's sleeping. He's sleeping. All this, all the sun and the surf has uh, gotten Hudson uh, sleepy. So you gotta watch out, people step right out in front of the car. Well, they're from different places. They're not yeah, used to traffic, they're, they're you know? They're used to it. Let's see what's I going think on you can pull out, because he's making a okay. turn. I he's think you're safe. Turn, yep, 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 I think you're safe. Right, Stay safe, go. James, stay safe. Yep. Got a chin up, chest out, guys. Okay, so we're gonna be making a right on Ocean Drive. Mark said, can you drive along the um, by the beach? And, and this is the part that we can, otherwise it's closed. So here we go, Mark. Here we go. Here we go. The green light. See, that's closed that north of here. Yeah, see, Mark, how the, uh, it's closed. The street is closed. The street is closed north. Now we're going to be right. We're paralleling the ocean. This is Ocean Drive. This is the closest you can get to the ocean nice Corvette. without being in the ocean. Whoa, look at and bike riders are out in the middle of the road. See passenger loading area. Now, if you see, if you happen to find a spot, now there are spots if here. You if you to happen to find a spot, James, I, I can always get out, not a passenger loading zone, and just show the beach very quickly. Sure. If you happen to find one. Beautiful girl in the world. If you happen to see the most so I'll, I'll help you, James, just in case I see someone getting in their car or something like that. We're not, you don't, you're not, you'll, you'll stay in the car because I think it's a little hot for Hudson, but I can just run out. The kiddos are waiting across the street, I think. Nope, okay, keep going here. Or they're waiting for a ride. That's, That's probably more like it. Exactly. Yep. See, people just run out. I, I'm trying to look everywhere. Yeah, hydrant. I'll just pull right in here. Perfect. James found a, a spot at the hydrant. I'm pulling those in. It's it's a George no. George Costanza would It's be a mad no at me. parking anytime, but not no standing. So James is being legal. Carlos gonna run out. And I am going to I'm like. going to run out to the beach and check out the situation. The sun of beach. James, I am going to take yeah, this. Gonna, just. Yep. You yeah, know, because yeah. you're not going to be going yeah. anywhere anyway. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I'm going to leave the the Ooh. the camera here, James. Yep. Yeah. Okay. If I have to move, I'm just going to go around the block. You'll find me. And you'll just, just come right, right back right here, here yeah, right? right? So I'm going to leave the camera right here, guys. I'm going to go out on the beach now to show you the beach because I am curious to see if it's crowded or not. So let me run across the the street here. And here we are at Ocean Beach Park in South Beach. I'm going to go out to the beach. There's a beach entrance and we'll see if it's crowded. I don't think it's going to be because I mean, there's hardly anybody on the street here. The nice thing is that there's uh, public restrooms right here, a kid's uh, playground area. See the restrooms, nice uh, covered area for the kiddies to play. Oh, hey, Terry Homer. Oh, no problem, Stephanie. We understand you're driving. <laughs> you 
Marion, you got to go. He's signing out now. Might be back later. Oh, no problem, Marion. Thank you for joining us. Hope you're feeling good. Hudson sends big kisses to you, Marion. Big kisses. So, guys, we're here in South Beach. We're going to check out the beach and see if how many people are on the beach. I can tell you there's hardly anybody on this path. This is a beautiful path that uh, you can use for bicycling, uh, running, and usually it's super crowded with people. I'm going to just spin around. And you can see it's uh, fairly empty right now. Now, I did hear that there's, um, they instituted a no smoking on the beach, too, that they would find you. But that guy was clearly smoking, so either just no one saw him. So here's the beach. Um, not that crowded. Not that crowded, guys. I mean, there's some people on the beach, but it's not, like, packed. There's uh, a lot of beach umbrellas, but there's nobody, like, that many people underneath the umbrellas. So here's the situation. You know, there's some people out on the beach. This is uh, from the Hotel Stanton. So this is their, um, the umbrellas from the hotel that they've set up. Wait, Sandra, I'm gonna add yeah, it's empty. To yeah, all the beach, restri all the restrictions that they've put in place have uh, scared people away. You know, there's very, very, very few people on the beach. You know? Yeah, very few people on the beach. I mean, and everyone seems they're like, they look, the people that are here look like they're having a great time, but very few people. I don't know, oh my God, the water looks gorgeous, guys. So here's the scene on the beach. Not that crowded. I mean, not for spring break time. Yeah, so here's the scene, guys. Oh my God, the water is beautifully crystal clear like a gorgeous like green is blue yeah there's very 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 few people here on the beach Yeah, doesn't it sound pretty? Okay, look at this pretty shell I found, guys. I picked up a pretty shell for you guys. Yeah, I mean, the weather couldn't be better, guys. Cruise ship out in the ocean. But not too many people. I mean, we've seen it a lot, lot busier. When there hasn't been this many restrictions, it's usually a lot, lot, lot busier. Oh my 
god, guys, look! A big cruise ship is going out! Look at that! Oh my god, don't you love watching that? Wow, we caught it just in time. Hold on, I'm gonna run. I'm running, guys. Isn't that fabulous? I'm loving it. That's the Carnival Horizon going out, guys. Oh, that's awesome. Look at that. How amazing is that? It's a big cruise ship. Carnival Horizon. Oh, what a cute little doggy on the beach. Wow, there's a lot of doggos on the beach. That one's cute. I'm going to get a photo, guys. Yeah, isn't that great, the cruise ship? Yeah, there's really not that many people out on the beach today. You know, it's generally um, a lot more crowded. You can see, and you know, this is, uh, like I said, peak season. Oh, I hear another cruise ship must be leaving. I hear the horn of another cruise ship. Yeah, that ship is moving. Yeah, the ships are close, right? Yeah, isn't it so pretty? I love watching the cruise ship go out to port. That was a carnival cruise ship. Icon of the Seas will also be leaving today, though that's the world's largest cruise ship. They're going out today, too. Yeah, definitely everyone has room. It's, it's very, it's, there's not a lot of crowds at the beach at all. I mean, I think with all the restrictions, it's really, uh, you know, not a lot of people at all. Want me to take a picture of the both of you guys? Okay. Okay, yeah, sure. No problem. Let me just put this shell in my pocket. I found a shell. Okay. <laughs> These girls are trying to take a selfie. It's like your arms aren't long enough. Do you want me to take it vertically like this? That's good? Yeah. That's All right. Here we go. All right, hold on, guys. I'll take a couple just to be, be, be sure. Oh, yeah, I did it. You're in the story. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Make sure you like it. Thank you. <laughs> Are you guys here on spring break? No, we live here. Oh, you live here. Yeah, yeah but you see, this hardly, it's calm, right? I know, yeah. I, I mean, it's, it's kind of nice in a way, right? It's like this, more or less. We're used to it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll have fun. Bye-bye. Okay. Yeah, I think it, it, it looks beautiful. 
it's extra good. Yeah, so guys, I mean, it couldn't be more gorgeous here at the beach. That's that's for sure. I mean, like, there's not a lot of people, but um, in a way, that's, you know, a good thing. I'm waiting to see. There's, there might be another cruise ship going out because I did hear... Sorry, guys. Um, yeah, so let me go check on and uh, check in on James. But everyone's here is having fun. Yeah, it looks pretty, right? Let's do, do another ASMR. We'll just go a little further. Listen, guys, listen, listen to that. Yeah, so I think another cruise ship is going to be leaving soon. I heard, I heard it, but I haven't, I don't see it yet. We got to give it like maybe, maybe another minute or so, and it will. So yeah, guys, we're just waiting to see if another cruise ship uh, leaves. So very calm here. Now it's green flag, so there's no warning today, but there's a uh, purple sea pests. So you have to be wary that there is some, there could be man of war, jellyfish out on the beach, but it's green flag for calm waters. I was just waiting to see if there's another cruise ship leaving, but. All right, let's uh let's head back and say, oh, this is the uh, Nikki Beach right here. This is uh. Oh, there's the cruise ship! I knew it! I knew it! I said, oh, we'll wait a couple of minutes and there'll be another cruise ship. Let me get back to the water. Look at this. Oh, how perfect, guys! Look at this, another cruise ship leaving, guys. This is on Norwegian cruise lines. Oh, extra good. Look at that. Look 
that, guys. Isn't that awesome? Oh, that's a big one. That's the Norwegian Joy. That's the Norwegian Joy, guys. Oh, that's a huge cruise ship, guys. But also uh, going to leave the Port of Miami today is the Icon of the Seas. Icon of the Seas will be leaving. That's the world's largest cruise ship. I'm just going to get another photo. Isn't that great? How was the water? Not too cold? Not terrible. <laughs> I think it's like 75 degrees Fahrenheit, something like that. The water temperature? Yeah. They said the water's not too cold. <laughs> All right, guys. So let me get back to James and Hudson. I'm glad to show you the beach. Yeah, this is government's cut. This is um, this is South uh, South Beach. This is the end. Is called government's cut, where the cruise ships leave to uh, go on their cruises out to uh, the Caribbean and beyond. Yeah, Brenda says that Norwegian Cruise Line is a huge cruise ship. It sure was. So that was a lot of fun to see. Glad we caught that. We're always giving you the best moments, right guys? Thanks. So let's head back out to uh, James. There's Miami Beach, there you go. No, it doesn't feel hot at all, it feels comfortable. It's perfect temperature, Mark. Not too hot, feels just right. To me, feels just right. No, Ivor, uh, George, the reason why there's so few people is that Miami Beach put a lot of restrictions in place that there's no on-street parking anymore, the parking garages, so we saw one that was charging $50 an hour, another one was like $100 flat rate. Um, oh, wow, check this out, guys. Look at this. Look at this. Look at all these shells I just got picked up. Oh, we're going to keep these for the garden. Isn't that awesome? Mark, um, we, the, I can't, I can't walk that far to where the boats are, where the boats come out at port. That's South Point Park because uh, James is parked too far away. Um, then I would have to walk a couple of miles back. I mean, I could do it, but, you know, there's other things we want to show right now. Hey, Rev Jen. Hope you're feeling transported to beautiful South Beach. That's where we are now. Um, I just showed some cruise ships heading out to the ocean. You can see there's the Norwegian cruise line, so I don't know if you can see it. I'm gonna hold it real high. There it is as it heads out to the water, to the Caribbean. And yeah. Let me go back to James, because he's uh, parked at a fire hydrant, because there's very few parking spots, because they took all the on-street parking away uh, beyond 5th Street. There's no on-street parking anymore beyond 5th Street. So there's very few, thank you, hi, there's very few parking spots available.
Yeah, doesn't it, isn't it beautiful here in South Beach? It's gorgeous, guys. So I'm gonna head back to James now because he and Hudson are in the, in the uh, rental car that we have. If you missed our uh, recorded video, we premiered it uh, yesterday. We did a recorded video of our drive from the rental car agency at the Fort Lauderdale Airport to Fort Lauderdale Beach. And we show you guys the best way that you can drive from Fort Lauderdale Airport to the beach. And we hope you guys enjoyed watching that video. So let me show you, look at, look at all these shells that I found. I'm just trying to tap some of the sand out of them. You know, they're not, they're not whole, they're like pieces of shells, but they're cute. That's a nice find. Oh, I see Hudson. He's looking out the window. Guys, hashtag no filter. They ban cigarette smoking, see? From public beaches. I was right. Hi, Hudson. Look what I got. He wants to eat it. Can you open the door for me, James? Beautiful. Aren't these great guys? That's a fantastic job. Can you pick up Did the you camera the for me? Sleeping? Yeah, we got I got them both on camera. Can you take um this for a minute? Just yeah, put that down doing, on guys? your lap. I gotta get this, some of the sand out of my shoes. Saturday, you know how we do it. James, I'm gonna just tap out some of the sand. Carla's out of my getting shoes. all the beach out of her shoes. You know, James goes to the beach, he loses a shoe, so oh let me see God. who's in here now. Jessica Betcher, welcome aboard. Hope you guys are enjoying your Saturday. Thanks for hanging out with us. Vincent P Padula, yeah, Hudson's right here, Vincent. Look at him. Little, me and Hudson are chillaxing. Class shelling, nice. Josh Dean. Mark, Carla, you got some nice shells. Yeah, Mark, out of way to say it. Out of boy, and then LA Beat, pop it in. Brenda Nelson. The BMW is still in the in our in our garage. We're waiting for the Mercedes to get back, guys. Hey, Reverend Jenny, no, we haven't gotten it back yet. Still in the repair shop. Still in the repair shop. James, set the, show the show how beautiful even that little park area is. There's a there's a area for kids to play. Yeah, look at that car. There's a Tesla with a wrap. Some beautiful cars going by. You wouldn't believe second, them. James, I'm almost done. I got one shoe done, but then yep. I, uh, I kind of nodded up. Hey, CAK. One. Yeah, Vincent saying he could sit all night all there and relax. Yeah, me too. Hey, Joe Mar Morgan, popping in 53, saying love the channel. Thanks right back at you, Joe. Thanks for hanging out with us. Thanks, Lockjaw. Lockjaw coming in the house tonight. Yeah, Hudster said that's not pizza. He said that is not pizza. Guys, it's uh, Saturday night on South Beach. Around the world, it's Saturday night. Should I uh, get Hudson some uh, water, James? Yeah, get him some water. He's having a nice time out here. All right, let me get his water bowl, okay? Yep, guys, look at this here. We're looking... This is looking uh, south down ocean. I'm going to put this away. Yeah, we're in the area of M South, south Beach of called South of Fifth. You got that? South of Fifth Street. All kinds of things going on here. We're checking out what's going on on South Beach. So Calling right. for snow tomorrow at our St. Patrick's Day Parade, MG Mustang said. Yeah, Icon of the Seas just left the uh, dock. Oh, so we uh, we missed that one. Uh, I saw the other ones though. Yeah. Oh, maybe I saw them down the end, the end of the block. block. Why don't we uh, do that? Well, you probably just... see it better from here because when you get up close, the trees are in the way. Oh, let's give Hudson some water, James. But it could be, you know. Yeah, 
Here we go, Mr. Hudson. Hey, Dennis, popping in. Welcome aboard, Dennis. Yep. Reverend Jen said, when are you going back to New York in May? No, not that late. We're waiting for our car to get settled. Because of the car, some, we took some, photo, some, some jobs that we took booked. some extra jobs and stuff. So, you know, not, not as late as May, I would say. No, we're not sure yet. As soon as we know, you Eat, will sleep, let you know. Eat, sleep, work, travel, repeat. Hudson's here in South Beach. So be, as the kids say. All right. Let me uh, grab that. Yeah, Hudson here we had go. his We're water. Off. Here's Hudson. Yeah, eat gads, guys. A lot going on out here. Busy Saturday night. So let, ho hold on. Part. One more second, James. I'm going to just put my seatbelt on. Belt and up. And... Strap yourself in. Okay. Uh, if we go... If, if like, just uh, when you pull out, see if you can see down the uh, end of the street. Yeah, I see saw the cruise ships go by. Right. That's what I'm saying. I can't see it from this side. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, you know what I mean? Pull out. Got to be careful of the bike lane. They've been zooming up and down. Right. The thing is so big that, you know, yeah. we'll just can see it from here. Hey, you know? hey, hey. Look at this here. Yeah, now I remember what you're saying about the Starbucks. See, now I, I got it. I knew what you, uh, yeah. what you meant. Oh, hey, Scott Bagley. That. How are you? Welcome aboard, Scott. Guys, we're here in South Beach. We're in the area south of Fifth, where they do allow on-the-street parking, but there's basically no spots because they're, they're so, they're, they don't allow on-street parking between Fifth Street and, um, you know, at least 17th, 17th Street, yeah. um, because that's as far as we went. It may be further. I'm not really sure, but that's as far as we got. You know, we can go up and not and just pull and you know, like we're going to go. But I think they cut that off, but I'll see. I think they put a gate no, since no. then. Oh, oh, I see. But you'll see. Yeah, you'll see. Well, I think they might have. Yeah, put a gate there. But... Understood. Because remember how slow it goes? It takes a little while. Lots of tape, probably. Yeah. The Nikki Beach lot is closed. Yeah, that looks full already. Yeah, I can loop around there if you want. Hmm. Yeah. You know, probably can't wait for very long, but maybe it'll work out. Yeah, it'll chase us out with a crudely fashioned broom. Guys, Am we're gonna... good here? What, what's yeah. going on? You're good, you're good. Guys, on the outside chance that the, the icon of the seas just happens to pass, like within the next couple of seconds, we'll be able to see it. Otherwise, uh, you know, we can't idle here for very long, but, um... Yeah, not, not at all, really. But I don't see it. You know, we could always zoom, zoom back around. Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't, I don't see her yet. I can go around down the other way if you want. Let's see. Oh, uh, Ellis Bowsley, uh, Joe Stone Crab specializes in stone crab. Uh, that's the only kind of crab it serves because stone crabs are a local uh, uh, species. You know, they, they are found in the waters here in South Florida. And Joe Stone Crabs was the first place to uh, serve uh, stone crabs. They're, they're boiled. And they're thrown in boiling water, and then they're served chilled. And remember, the crabs regenerate their claw. Right. They only they don't kill the crab; they regenerate their the claw. Can you see her in the rear view as it's there or not? No. Okay. I'll turn down. The mighty bull just sent us four ninety nine. Mighty bull, fantastic job! Oh, have a beautiful job. day. Oh, let me show you the best There's pit the bull. Hunster. Here he is on his little new blanket, his dreaming, dreaming a pizza blanket. Yeah, but it's he's a dreaming of pizza. It's the beautiful uh, cloud blanket. And Vic Vincent Padula is going to send. Hudson has his pizza collar on. He's going to be sending the matching, the matching leash. Oh my God, that's so sweet, Vincent. Look, Hudson's got the collar on. I don't know if you could see it. I gotta pick up Hudson's head to show it, but he's got the collar Here's on. Colin, so I'm Thank you, Vincent. I don't even see it up this way, so yeah. You know, it takes a while to 
kind of float away. And exactly, I, I agree. This is the back of Joe's Stone Crab. Right, this is the parking lot. You should be able to park for, here for basically free. Right, this is the parking lot for Joe's ago. Stone Crab on the left. Oh, hey, uh, Janice and Rocha saying, hey, James and Carla. Zach Farr saying, what a cute dog. Oh, let me show you Hudson again. The Hudson. Look at that, guys. He's on his dream blanket. Yeah, he's in, he's getting the AC blowing on him. He's staying cool. Oh, look at this. Oh, wow. Look at all those uh, uh, look, officers on bicycles. Officers on bicycles. Yeah, look, a whole phalanx. Yes, we're in South Point. Exactly, super bad mofo one. Super bad mofo one. Oh, it. thank you. Thank you, Vincent. That's so sweet. He's getting us the matching leash. Oh, nice. That's prime With fish. With the pizza. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Vincent knows what's going on. This is the restaurant Big Pink. We've eaten here before. But oh yeah, this is a, this is a fun fun restaurant. I had I had the salmon and it was a little dry. Yeah. And so was the rice. Yeah. I'm just just yeah saying. because you were trying to be healthy and eat the salmon, not eat uh, my hamburger. Yeah, we've eaten here before, but not during a recorded, not during a live video. But this is a, a cute option. I wasn't um, impressed. You know. A simple food. I mean, it's probably more the the atmosphere. The, the atmosphere than than the than the great food here at Big Pink. But yeah, you know, I, I just I just call it like I see it. Class Schelling said Hudson heard the word pizza and got up. Yeah, you he know, did. You are absolutely a hundred percent right about that. A hundred percent right. Let me show you, Sweet Boy Hudson, again. He's like, did anyone say pizza? I thought I heard the word pizza. Chances are. Cause I wear a silly green. Do, 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 do. Oh, look at this um, wrapped Rolls Royce Bentonia. Wow. They're trying to park behind it. They don't want to hit it. That's like a mortgage. Yeah. That's that bumper. So you gotta let everybody. Juan El said that's a bike patrol. You gotcha. Bike patrol. Yeah, yeah. I saw that. Keeping Looks it like safe. One of my, a dozen of them. Guys, everything's been very um, safe. I mean, Sedate. I don't yeah, say any problems. Here. Coming back from the beach. Eating an apple, some girls. That's a good snack. A healthy snack. Kudos to them for having an apple. Nothing's it's a nice better than snack. a good apple. There's the Chewbacca Tesla. Oh, yeah, that we saw before. It's yeah. not a I don't think it's a Tesla. I think it's just a... Yeah, um, it's a oh, it's a Capri or something? Oh, no, you're right. It is a Tesla. Gosh, Tesla. James. Yeah. Chewbacca Tesla. Look, it looks like Zeus. Wait till Nick G sees that Chewbacca Tesla, a brown Tesla. I wonder if they have that in the UK. Yeah, if they do that in the UK. It might have been custom. So, guys, now, Fifth Street is where the restrictions start. So, their parking is $20 in that lot. That's a but lot. But once you cross, uh, once you cross Fifth Street here, the price of parking is going to go up considerably because they've taken away all on-street parking. Calgon, take me away. That's what all the parking... So we're going to just um, drive north now on Collins. Yep. Guys, our, our goal is Until to the head wheels come off. north on Collins and show you the rest of what's going on in South Beach. See what, see what we find. I just want to look outside. I'm going to put uh, one X. No, we're good. I think oh, he's Hutch is sacked out. He's, he's sacked out. Blanket. Exactly. He's like that. Unless there's pizza out there. Sing it, Johnny Mathis says Perry Wilkes. Yeah. So those shells are they're funny, right? Yeah. Look at this one. This is the nicest one. I mean, it's it's beat up. I'm getting sand all over the place. Oh, that's great. A little cock. Immature cock. Yeah. A fighting cock. Uh, immature. Yeah. It doesn't have its lip. And this one, you know, is a, is a, a whelk. big cut of whelk. Oh, super bad mofo one just sent us $10. Says there's a spot on 14th Street between Collins and Ocean called La Sandwich Tree. And oh my God, it has great sandwiches. Delicious. Oh, oh my God. 14th Street, that's the street. Isn't that yeah. the street that we were, um, that's where, um. Latope. No, 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 no. Right no. here. That's, yeah, um, yeah. that's a. I can't wait, think of a name right super now. bad mofo. Isn't that the same street that. Club Deuce is on? Club Deuce. Max's Club Deuce. Max's Club Why Deuce? Why the name? I couldn't even think of the name. Oh, so you know what? Super bad mofo. Once this um, 
Spring break. Spring sorry. break tomfoolery stops. Oh, what car is that? Oh, that's just a Corvette, right? Yeah. Oh, but look, look at that. Lambo. Lambo. Wow, Once he's that, a big guy. We will, I'm going to write that down. I'm going to write that. Oh, that's a, wow. Look at yeah, this. Yeah, that has Lambo doors. That's a uh, It's a girly driving it. It's a McLaren. The girly's driving the McLaren, He let James. her drive it. He let her drive it. The McLaren. Yeah. So thank you so much for that uh, super bad mofo one. We will check that out. La Sandwichery. Now, what, what sandwich do you recommend? Because I don't think we're going to be able to stop today because, I mean, there's literally, the parking is so ridiculous or prohibitively expensive here. And, uh, you know, we'd rather show spring you guys. Spring break will be over in a week. Yeah, so. spring break will be over in a week. And we're, we're going to be down here um, for a, a, while, a little while longer. So we'd love Whoa, to check out. Oh, look at that out. Porsche. Oh, that is a nice Porsche. Look at that. Yeah, he's got delivery on it. Um, what That's sandwich do you recommend? Do you have a favorite sandwich from there? Because Hudson's favorite food is food. I mean, yeah. he'll eat any sandwich. I think the kids call them Sammy's. Yeah. What's your favorite sandwich? Yeah, we remember Wolfie's DN. Oh, of, of course. course. Wolfie's. And Rascals. And Eat, Sleep, Work, Travel, Repeat also remembers to go to uh, Rascal Wolfie's. Rascal House. Yeah, uh, Wolfie's Rascal House. Yeah. Um, that was on the corner right by Lincoln Road, right? Yeah. Oh, super bad mofo ones likes the smoked salmon with brie cheese. Oh. oh. Now you're talking my Now language. you're talking. That's like a New York bagel sandwich. Yeah, super like bad. Like we, we, we love the smoked Nova salmon on, on everything bagel with capers. Tomato, red tomato. Cream cheese, red tomato, and sliced onion from Russ and Daughters on East Houston Street in New York City. Yeah, you could make swear on that one. Yeah. Now, another great spot, if you love Cuban food, I can recommend this, highly recommend Porta Segura, which is coming up right on the left, the corner of 7th Street and Collins. We've, it's for dur during live streams, we've highlighted it. It's a wonderful family-owned Cuban restaurant, and they have not only amazing sandwiches, but great fish. We had a great um, fish there. We're gonna ride. A whole fish. Now you can see, usually it's packed, but that's what I'm saying about these restrictions. I feel bad that places like Porta Segua, who uh, who depend on small business uh, peak during spring break, I feel bad. There's not that many people in there. Look, the counter seats are empty. Look, James. Yes. Porquita mañana and come to Havana with me. So we understand why the um, why the authorities have put the restrictions in place. But at the same time, because we're we're hey, a Ferrari. That's I see a nice that one. we we particularly love That's to a support. Ferrari. It is small businesses that it's it's hard to see them suffer like that. Yeah, Perry Wilkes says Wolfie's closed in two thousand three, and the Rascal House in two thousand eight. Don't put another dime in the jukebox. I don't want to hear that song no more. <laughs> Look at that song. Uh, that that uh, shop is called Vacation Junkie. Oh yeah, you're just <laughs> you're hooked on vacationing, guys. Let me tell you that much. Eat, sleep. Well, we come down here from for um, for business, you know, because we're architectural and interior photographers. Yeah. So we come down here. Um, you know, we spend a few months, then we back in New York and spend a few months, travel around, back to Florida. You know, we're back and forth a lot. To pass the port day. So as you can see, the buildings uh, are beautiful. Oh, we're in the we're in the historic Art Deco district. Yeah, it's just gorgeous, guys. Guys, eighty four degrees. Hey, Christine Holling, saying hi. Yes, Rev Jen, they changed the rules for spring break. Number one, they, they took away all the parking on the street. That's just for spring break that they did that. And then number two, what they also did is in, and they installed a, um, they, see these roads are closed, but sometimes they do that anyway because they close Ocean Drive. But what they also did is they put a curfew in effect. So the curfew is in place um, tonight from 12 midnight you know from midnight to 6 a.m so it's discouraging a lot of um kids from coming down for spring break so might as well stay here and let them cross if they want yeah let me pull up do 
Do we remember Stuckies? Oh, of course. Stuckies. We see Stuckies on the on the drive down from New York to Florida. We used to see a lot no, of Stuckies. What was Jerry's, the, the the deli. Oh yeah, Jerry's famous deli. That took that took place of where the Wolfies used to be. No. Yeah. Did it? No. The Wolfies was further north. Oh then, right. The Wolfies was further north. And then Rascal's house was even further north. Than right. That. Michelle Norton says, "I feel like I'm in the back seat." Let me show you, Mr. Sweet Boy Hudson. Here he is. There he is. Vincent says, I got to buy a, a condo uh, for myself in Florida, then I can go whenever I want. Oh, Kate uh, says, wow, curfew. What happens if you're 60 years old? Kate Summers, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Uh, the, the curfew is in place for everyone. I mean, except if you reside in South Beach. I mean, and, and if you work, you know, then you're exempt. But the, the all the restaurants, everything has to close. And look at how they barricaded all the parking. So it's really put a damper on the small businesses. And, I mean, I would say the hotel industry, too. Yeah. So anyone that's in the, the service industry as far as hotels, you know, it's got to hurt their bottom line as well because... You know, no one wants to come down for spring break and then there's a curfew in place if you wanted to go out and have fun. Yeah. Look at how they barricaded each side of the street, guys. Eat, sleep, work, travel, repeat says, Hudson's just a handsome looking boy. Oh. The yeah, Hudson. they really. Oh, CPQ trainer just tuned in. Are you guys leaving or coming? Oh, uh, we're still in South Beach. We're, we're, we're checking out the scene here for spring break. Um, I was out on the beach uh, just before. If you rewind the the live stream back, we saw um, some beautiful cruise ships leaving the port of Miami, including a Norwegian cruise line and a um, uh, what was that other one? I forget. Yeah, I didn't see it. I can only see the top of it, the very top. One of the that popular one, Celebrity. Celebrity. Celebrity that yeah. was it. Yeah, with the red and white and blue uh, chimney. Exactly. So guys, they've taken away the on-street parking. As you can see, there's much less people walking along there's the street. There's a real Hummer. Oh wow, that is a that is a expensive Hummer, a gas guzzler, I would say. I would say so. But you're, you're not worried about mileage when you buy that thing. No, that's not a concern of yours. Whoops, someone. Yeah, Rev Jen also feels for the small businesses. PDX Jeff says terrible decision by the old city politicians. Well, I mean, like, like I said, I mean, we don't get into politics on this channel, and that's one kind of an unwritten rule. You know, we're happy to have everyone. That's written in stone. Right, basically. we're happy to have everyone chat with us. Like, Every time we've we been down here, everyone's We don't been restrict great. our streams to um, people that are subscribed to our channel. We let everybody chat, even, even if you're not subscribed. I mean, of course, we love you for to you to subscribe if you're enjoying this video. By the way please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new to our channel. But we have the chat open to everybody. We don't install, we don't have like a lot of rules for the chat, but See, we want everyone A, to be friendly and respectful and B, no drama. Uh, we're a positive channel. We, we are all about positivity and we don't do political discussions because that's just not, you know, in this day and age, not a positive thing. That looks she's kind banging of, her shoes out. Right. It can lead to negativity, which we don't like to do. So uh, we respect that they want to keep things safe. Oh, they, look at that blue. Um, look at that color blue. If you can. Well, now it's... Oh, I see it. It's like a marine blue. Yeah. Um, we understand that there's. Uh, they want to keep people safe, but there's a fine line between safety and going overboard. And look at that. $60. Sixty dollars. That's a sixty dollars to park penny. there. For, There's the McLaren for five hours. Sixty dollars to park at that spot for five, five hours. hours. Oh my God! They better give you a back rub. Sixty dollars for guys. that money. I want a back rub and a couple of hot dogs. So that's why they they and that's not because they're trying to gouge you. The the city of Miami made all the parking lots. They they told them to charge an inordinate amount to park. Because they're trying to dissuade spring breakers from coming down here. So this is a rule that they put in place. And it's, you know, it ruins it for everyone else that would have been having a good time. Because not everyone comes down here with the, ex with the intent of causing havoc. Right. C 
so it's it's sad. What's this, James? A Corvette. Corvette. See, the girls are having fun. Like, look at them. They, do they look like they're going to cause any drama? No. They look no. like they're having fun. What's this up here? What's that off? Another uh, vet? Corvette, yeah. yeah. Corvettes are coming in through the windows here. So, like to nothing. us... In Here's another one. Putting all these uh, restrictions, such as no parking and charging a lot for parking lots and uh, install putting up the curfew for midnight to 6 a.m., all it does is hurt small businesses. For a couple of knuckleheads. Right. It hurts. If say you say you work as a say you work as a waitress. You make your living as a you waitress. Tips. And now you've lost all that income on tips. Look at that now, double. What if you're what if you're there. supporting a family of five yeah, on no, your on deal. your income from tips? Business owners, you they're right? Not, they're not they're not you know uh, cutting your taxes for this weekend. Exactly. It's not like they're they're giving everybody money that says Tax okay. forgiveness for this weekend. Right. Look so, at a car. Look at a car. That's the look issue. At that I know. I see that. Two look tone. at that. Two that's tone. that's the issue that we have. I mean, we understand the rules. We understand why they, they put them in place, but, you know, a lot of it we have to say, you know, it's tough to agree with it all, you know, when it comes to things like that. Yeah. You don't want to throw the baby out with the bathwater. You know exactly. What I'm that's the saying. Spring Breakers bring in a lot of money to the city of Miami. Exactly, Brendan Nelson. It's, and it's not just the city. I mean, it's it's the people who work here, the people who live here. I mean, you might not even live in Miami, but you might work in Miami, and now and now your business is forced to close. You know, say it's a you work at a nightclub. I mean, you know, say whatever. Like I said, you work as a waitress, you work as a bartender. Now the bar has to close by midnight. They're trying to bike in all the bike lanes. So although these decisions might seem good on paper, you know, to protect the public, you know, there's more to it than that. But like I said, end of that discussion because, you know, it doesn't, uh, it's, it's, we, we want to be positive. The positive thing is we're enjoying ourselves right now. And, it looks and we saw a beautiful 1957 Chevy Bel Air parked in front. Max's, uh, Club, Max's Deuce. Club Deuce and my day is, is complete because of that. Yeah. The owner of Mangoes is okay with the curfew. He prefers the safety yeah. over money. CPQ Trainer, that's great for the owner of Mangoes. But what about the waitresses well, at Mangoes? Mangoes is, is right on the strip. Right. But so what about what about no, right, but yeah. but what about the waitresses that would have yeah, made money? Of course. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's that's a, that, that's the thing. We understand the small business owners. They want safety too. They don't want any problems in their business. No, that's silly. You know? Oh, look, hey, look at that, that purple, purple purple Lamborghini. Yeah, with the big huge ironing board on the Oh, that's a Oh, so wait. Is you Lamborghini the one that has the bull? Bull, yeah. Yeah, mighty so that's bull. a mighty bull sighting then. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so senior frogs is that's the used to be the deli where yeah. senior frogs is right yeah, that there, used to be the, 14th the deli. Street. Exactly. Yep. Tim, uh, Tim says, my goodness, police everywhere. Yeah, there's a huge police presence. Look at presence. those colors. They're so Florida. Yeah, look at that. What James is pointing out. Look at those pastel colors. So Florida. Wow, she's got to slow down. There's a lot so of So guys, I'm gonna, the, um, you're going to hear a mic change? Microphone is changing. I have to charge the uh, battery for Microphone the... Microphone is changing. I have to charge the battery for the phone for a little Microphone bit. Microphone is changing. Can you guys um, still hear me? Um, let me know if uh, let me know if you can hear me. Um, okay, I had to change the external microphone. It's no longer connected. Let me know if it sounds okay. Every day we're buffering. There we go. I'm back. Take a buffering, guys. It'll be it'll pass. I keep looking for someone we might know, but I, I know the chances are so slim. From up north even. Yeah, it wouldn't, right, they wouldn't have had to have all these cops and all these restrictions in place if that uh, the um, stuff that, it, that happened last year hadn't happened. That's exactly true. And it's like, uh, you know, 1.9% are knuckleheads. So it has to ruin it for the other 98%. Precisely.
can you know, probably go to the right. Butters, Butters. So guys, we're crossing Lincoln Road now. We're we're heading on north on um, Collins. This is uh look at that beautiful Sagamore. Guys, we're headed north. That's where we're headed now um, because we're going to check out how the um, crowd situation is in the more northern parts of South Beach. We're still in South Beach. Look at this Porsche. Serious. Turbo. Yeah, there's some beautiful cars. Yeah. I mean, oh, look at the color of this Lambo. Or, look or, at that Lambo color. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. We're, gonna, we're seeing some crazy color cars tonight, huh, James? Yeah, Rev Jen says there's always a bad apple in every bunch. Yeah, that's the thing, you Rev know? Rev Jen knows it. You got it. Yeah, you know it. You see, like, even along here, usually there would be way more people walking. Oh, it would be just packed. Back to back, belly to belly. Kate Summer says, I hope they don't go to Fort Lauderdale and ruin that. We were in Fort Lauderdale. Guys, you can fine. watch our live stream. We were there on Wednesday, and we were there last Saturday, and everything was fine. We interviewed kids on the beach. We walked along the beach with Sweet Boy Hudson. Oh, the kids were great. And the kids were really being well-behaved. Just having fun. They did clear the beach at 6 p.m., and that's the same rule goes for the beach here um, in South Beach. They're yeah, that's why everyone it. was going they're, off the they're beach. They're closing it at 6 p.m. That's why every, um, the beach is now closed here. For the night. Uh, for the uh, night. International City Beach. Right. Used to be open 24 hours. The beach is now closed here in South Beach. Beach used to be open 24 hours here. Then it went to midnight. Now it's now for this, it's 6 p.m. Yes, Eat, Sleep, World, Travel, Repeat says, James is a real car lover, as are you, Carla. Yeah, we, we're, we're, we're car spotters. I like my cars. Yeah. Perry Wilk says, I remember when they paid spring breakers to come to Jacksonville <laughs> uh, because Daytona was popular. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I mean, now they're they're basically, they're almost like, you know, they, they close the doors here in Miami to spring breakers. Yeah. That would be a good word. Uh, good. Yeah. I mean, I think I'm going to re rename the video Miami uh, Beach closed to spring breakers. Yeah. That's what I should rename doing. the video. A lot of people are having a nice night out here. I mean, it's... I know, but they basically shut it down. Yeah. I talked to people on the beach. They were from they were from Miami. Yeah. The two girls. They probably live right here. Yeah, that's what they said. I asked, where are you from? They said, we live here. We live here. <laughs> yeah, right here. And then I talked to some girls um, on the street who were uh, vacationing, and they were having fun. But, you know, um, they said everyone was acting uh, real nice. Yeah, of course. That's a majority. CPQ trainer says the crowds are going to go to Winwood or Brickell during curfew. Yeah. That's what I heard, yeah. CAK813 says, that's a shame. I'd love to see the beach, um, to see the sunset after 6 p.m. Well, that's out. That's that's gone now. That's not happening. Yeah, that thing No sunset away. on the beach. Look at this here. Oh, see, this is where it starts. Oh, so this is the... This um, is the checkpoint This later. is the no-go zone. It's 7 p.m. They start the DUI checkpoint. Right. Right here. Right here is where the... Where the where now the, we're outside the red zone. The no-go zone. We'll call it the no-go zone. Yeah. So basically it starts at 22nd Street. Uh, essentially, yeah. Yeah. Unless they roll up a little ways. Right. I think I remember reading that, though. From so from, so from 5th Street to 22nd Street is the no-go zone. Curfew, Lambo midnight. SUV. Yeah, I see that. Look at that green monster. Yeah. Not a Corvette. God. Yeah, but um, we we loved it at um, Fort Lauderdale Beach, and we 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 saw a beautiful sunset, guys. If you want to see a gorgeous sunset, watch last Saturday night's video from Fort Lauderdale. It was absolutely Fort. stunning. Enjoying, um, guys. I hope you're enjoying We're this just drive. We're picking a route, guys. 
Yeah, Jameson um, was talking about whether we should continue along um, I'm loving it. A1A here, Collins Avenue, which is hugging the beach. Uh, I don't see why not. What do you think, guys? Yeah, why not? Look, this is nice here, the Hilton Garden Inn. Look at how nice and serene that looks. Tiger Lily says, I'm sure a lot of small businesses are taking care of their staff as best they can, given that many small businesses treat their staff like family. That is a wonderful Nicely thought. Nicely put, Vincent. No, that wasn't Vincent. That was oh. actually Tiger Lily, 2013. Tiger Lily, nice job. 20, uh, that is so well said. I yeah. hope so, too. Yeah, I hope so, too. I hope so, too. But you're absolutely right. Small businesses are like family um, with their, you know, they treat their their employees. are. Many, many of them have been with them for many, many years. Look at how too. pretty this is up here. Yeah, look at that. Look at the, how they're redoing this building. Wow. Yeah, gutting it. Or is that brand new? Yeah, I guess. Wow, we haven't been up this way. Yeah. This so is that's what I said. You come over yeah. and you walk like this area. Yeah, we'll have to walk this um, on nine, you know, when it's not so warm. Not so spring breaky either. Right. PDX Jeff says those Lambos that you saw probably are all rentals. Yeah, yeah you're, you're true. probably right. You're probably right. Vincent says, I'm always enjoying your streaming. Don't go home yet. Take your time. Oh, Rev Jen says, I am enjoying the car ride since I'm always um, walking here while I'm at home. Nice. So they're loving it. Extra good. Oh, look at this. These are all flight attendants. Yeah, for Air Emirates, right? Yeah, that's what it looked like. What's that airline? So Emirates. United uh, Arab Emirates. Uh, yeah. Emirates. Yeah. Right, right, right. Wow, look at this place is busy. The Hamp the Paola. Paola. CAK813 says the cops would have to keep an eye on me because I'm a rowdy 72 year old who likes to walk on the beach and pick up a few, a few shells and watch the sunset. Yeah, <laughs> that's who they're targeting. Yeah, that's that's their target audience. You'd be right in their sights. The guy in your sights. Oh my God. Handcuffing you. <laughs> You'll be thrown into the slammer yeah, for picking up some shells. <laughs> yeah, oh troublemaker. Oh my God. Staying out past curfew, you troublemaker, you. Yeah. Yeah, we haven't. This is perfect. Yeah, nice, right? Mm hmm. Look at that out there, too. That's what I. Yeah. Look at this a big line to get into the Radisson. Yeah, I think, you know, people that are the vacationing with their families and stuff are probably staying more north over here yeah, it's so because quiet, the restrictions nice. aren't in place up this yeah. way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can just... Yeah, yeah, it's a nice area, right, guys? Yeah, this is nice here. Yeah, yeah. Kay and Maine said this is a nice area. Yeah, there's some be beautiful hotels around here. Mm. You see this uh, Indian yeah, Creek see, Drive is, is the next signal. Yep. Gotta be careful. Yeah, I look out, but I mean. Wow, look at that. The Soho Beach House. Look at that. Ferraris, yeah, uh, Lamborghinis, Porsches. Wow. They're balling over there, right? Wow, look at the sun. It's just right into our windshield here. Wow. This is where the old boat show used to be. Yes. So now, and when now A1A switches to Collins Avenue, that's where we're on now. No, Collins and to um, there's some big historic hotels like you the Fountain Blue. And uh, some some gorgeous hotels along here as well. Yeah. yeah, we were on. Um, we were. I I, got, I said it incorrectly before. Look at these yachts, huh? There's the fountain blue. We've toured that. There's the fountain blue. We've gone in there. We've uh, live streamed from there. Still heavy police presence around here. Hi, Huds. Mark, the beach is right here. Mark, they're behind the condos. The, the beach is right here. This yeah, is, the intercoastal's on our left. Yeah, the beach is right here, Mark. I mean, we can't we can't show you the beach because there's it's all the access is closed because these are all private hotels. They, they, they we've have walked out there before. We've we showed it. This is the Eden Rock. These these are private. You can't just enter the beach well, right look at now. Look how busy it is. Yeah, everyone's staying in this part. Although Mid Beach, this would be called Mid Beach. Mid Beach. Okay. 
they closed the beach now on South Beach, so you wouldn't be allowed to go out on the beach even if you were on the beach. No, liquor stores close at, uh, I think, 6 or 7 as well. Okay. okay. Guys, we're, we're heading north now on A1A. This is still Miami Beach. Right. But. So, Mark, the beach is right here. There's the beach. Yep. Right there. We're paralleling the beach, Mark. And there's beautiful. I mean, look at those mansions. <laughs> look right. at those mansions across the way there. Yeah, just gorgeous, huh? Oh, We've wow. loved along here, guys. We've done. So this is still the done... South Beach curfew zone up here. Wow, this is, or they're just announcing it. You know what I mean? Oh, I got you. Yep, I got you. Just let people know up here. Yeah, exactly. But if you're heading down south. Right. So guys, this area is called Mid Beach. We're still in Miami Beach, but this is like the Mid Beach area. There's some gorgeous hotels. We just passed by the Fountain Blue, the Eden Rock. And we've live streamed from this area and we visited the, uh, went inside the Fountain Blue Hotel. It was beautiful. Oh, Perry Wilkes used to love the mural, the uh, optical painting on the side of the building of Fountain Blue, but it's no longer. Mark, they put in a uh, curfew in effect because of the problems last year um, that spring breakers caused. They uh, put a curfew on South Beach from midnight and they closed the beach at 6 p.m. You know, you used to be able to stay out of the beach all night. James and I used to go to the winter music uh yeah. winter music conference uh you know the festival the music festival that happens and you would be out on the beach at like 4 a.m yeah listening to the music oh my god look at those homes yeah they're nice wow 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 those are nice homes oh they look at this they're tearing this down and they're building a new beachfront residences the paragon the paragon miami beach sales gallery now open. Wow, some dark clouds north yeah It's just pretty to drive this. It's very pretty. Yeah, me and Carl did this what, 30 years ago, for God's sake. It was not as many. These were here. This area's been like this a, lot, a long time. The new ones start just north of here, remember? Oh, I remember Penrod's in Miami. Oh, yeah. Now there's Nikki Beach. That's still there. That's still there. Right. With the little teepees. Right. The tiki huts. Yeah, like a teepee almost. Yeah, they renovated the Fountain Blue. Yes, um, Alice ba Bowsley, we have been to Singer Island and we live streamed from there a couple of weeks ago. That was fantastic. Um, please, uh, please, if, you, um, if you're not subscribed to our channel, we'd love for you to subscribe. You can watch some of our uh, videos from earlier this. We have a playlist. I will put it up as a, uh, um, I think there's a playlist for here. It's, um, no, I think it's a, the, I'd have to do, you'd have to go to the Palm Beach playlist. I made a Palm Beach playlist and we went to Singer Island. So there would be the Palm Beach playlist and you'll find a, or no, I think, not Singer Island. Yeah, that's still Palm Beaches. So yeah, it was beautiful. Yeah, it was and Riviera Beach we went to also. Yep. That's, you know, part of the scene. Oh, you have friends that live in Jupiter, says Eat Sleep. Oh, oh yes, nice. yeah, Jupiter is there. beautiful. Real nice. Yeah, and uh, we did a live stream over this summer from Stewart, which is just north of Jupiter. And that was beautiful. Along the water there. Yeah, just lovely. Really lovely. So, guys, if you're just joining us, we are in Miami Beach. We're driving north Look at that, the mile. along A1A. North. See, the problem with living right here is there's no stores or anything right here. Well, yeah, you have, you have to, to go drive, drive to get your groceries and stuff. If I live in an apartment, I'd want it, like, convenient. These are pretty. And that's the why view. they haven't delivered, I guess. Yeah, exactly. The view is so pretty. You get water on both sides. I mean. Oh, eat, sleep, work, travel, feet, says um, their friend has a boat. Yeah, Singer Island has some beautiful uh, deep water dockage. It sure does, yeah. Yeah, look at all the money, yeah. These condos are expensive, guys, to live here.
Mr. Cruise Fever says hello, hello everyone. Mr. Welcome, Cruise Mr. Fever. Cruise Fever. I believe that you're new to our chat. Thank you for joining. Um, like I said, if you're new, uh, we welcome everyone. We'd love for you. Um, welcome aboard. Yeah, welcome aboard. We'd love for you to subscribe if you're liking this content. Look at Casablanca. Oh, look at that Casablanca. Look at that. And up there too. Yeah, oh, that's, that's awesome. Great. Oh, I love the um, the, like the the statues holding up the uh, yeah, the cantilever down. The chariotips. Yeah. There's Monte Carlo. I'm the one who broke the bank at Monte Carlo. Oh, I don't know that song. Wow, those do look like dark clouds. Hey, Lady Old, that's a 56. <gasps> oh, look at this. That's a 56. Yeah, that's the, and it's not in that great a condition. No, they use it for advertising. Yeah. Though. So the beach is right here. We're hugging the beach. This beach is still, um, you can still go out on the beach here because that's South Beach that they put the restrictions. This is hopping up here. Yeah. More people in the restaurants up here. Yeah. Vincent Padula says, sing it, James. Ah, oh, you know me, Vincent. Oh, is Walgreens still open? Yes, the Walgreens are still open. That's a big um, chain down here. Of, an IHOP. Uh, and look at IHOP. You don't see too many of those around anymore. Uh, International House of Pancakes. Now we're in North Beach. Yeah, now we're in the area called North Beach, guys. North Beach Leather. Oh, did we get that? That's past Aventura. We do we pass by the Aventura yet? Uh, I don't know if this is considered North Beach I yet. I think it is. We're seventy second, seventy ninth. Alex Burrell just sent us 10 um, pounds. Thank you so Alex Burrell, much. Alex Burrell, job. that is so sweet of you. Let me show you a sweet boy Hudson. Look at him. He's That's in the back seat. Job. Look at how he has his leg. Do you see how the leg is draped? Yeah, He's loving blanket. this um, rental car. This is blanket. a Ford Edge, in case you're wondering, guys. Ceviches. This is a Ford Edge that we're driving. It's a 2024 Ford Edge. I remember when Derek Jeter would uh, do ads for the Ford Edge. Uh, thank you, Alex. That's so sweet of you. Oh, look at this here. Yeah, see, this is North Beach. Here. Yeah, look how pretty. Wow, look at this little band show. Wow, this is gorgeous. Looks like there's an event on. I see lights. Afro out. Roots Fest. Wow. The Miami Beach Band Show. Wow. Yeah, I saw lights on the stage, like they're testing them and stuff. Unless it's going on. Yeah, right this now. is where we um, this is where we walked with AK. I remember this is yep. definitely North yeah, Beach. Yeah, there's an old, the old style Remember we Della. went in there, yeah, we, yeah. and we got um, we got some uh, goodies from the Moises Bakery over here. Yep. There. Yeah. Look. Gaffa's Optical. Yeah. Collins and remember there was market. a um old Italian place. Deli. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I picked up a little pocket coat. Look at all the mist that are keeping people cool. Yeah, the bill, we just passed the Walgreens. It's still open. See, there's Goldstein's Prime. Here in North Prime. Beach. Yep. It's, oh, out, it's of out of business. business. Yeah. Wow. That sucks. That's bad. See North Shore Branch Library. Yep. How right you are. You go, James. You go. Oh, Kate Summers. Uh, we, we would. Uh, we would love. Um, Kate. Uh, AK is in. Is in. Um, Thailand. Is in the east now. Yeah, the he's, far east. Yeah, yeah, he's in the far east now. So it'd be a little difficult to. to little farther than the East Village. Right. It would be a little difficult to, to get together with him. But if he, if well, we, he could, he'll be back. He'll and, be back eventually. Yeah, we'll see him. We'll see him whenever he gets back. Yeah. Looks like he's having a great time. Yeah, he's having a great time in Thailand. Now this is expensive. This uh, TRD Sport Four Runner. Those are a pretty penny. Tell you that. It could actually go off road. Yeah. No, he's not in Taiwan. I didn't think, Michael. I thought. I thought. I mean, maybe I. I haven't. I haven't been able to catch up on his last video. But yeah. I thought. I, I thought, thought he was in around. Bangkok. Yeah, that's right. I thought. I thought he's in Bangkok now. One night in Bangkok, make a the hard man, man humble. humble. Da, na, 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 na. 
Guys, do you remember that song? Um, Head. The guy was, his name was uh, Richard Head or something. Oh, that sings that? One yeah. Leg in Bangkok? Yeah. Murray Head. Yeah, CAK813 is confirming what we said that he's in Bangkok. See? Yeah. I know. We know our AK. We just spoke with AK just um just the other day. I mean, not on the phone. We text him back and forth. Yeah, you we know, were late at night. He was early in the morning. Yeah, we're good friends with him. We happened to be up at 2 o'clock in the morning. So we were texting like, him uh, because it was like morning there, you know? Yeah, the next day. Like, yeah, he gave us some good recommendations. We wanted a, uh, we wanted some, um, we needed to upgrade some of our equipment. In fact, guys, I want to just uh, tell you right now, anytime... You know, you give a super chat, super sticker, or you're a Patreon or YouTube member. We put the money right back into the channel um, by either, A, we support small businesses. Oh, that's pretty... Um, or we put it in Hudson's or, stomach. Right, or we oh, get new equipment. And one of the equipment uh, that we got, I mean, I'll show it to you guys. Um, AK recommended it, is that we get this uh, GoPro it's mount. steady when we're driving. To do um, some uh, videos. <laughs> while we're in this SUV. Yep. So, um, big ups to AK for um, recommending that. Thank you very much. He's always on point. Yeah, yeah. He always helps us out. Guys, us live streamers, we gotta stick together. The Four Seasons is on the right. Yep. What car is this? I hear it. Brenda Nelson says she bought a Ford Edge many years ago. Uh, she traded in and bought a newer model. Yeah, this is this is a 2024 Ford Edge. That's what um, we're we're driving it from Enterprise Rent a Car. Oh, you know, yeah, this isn't an ad for down. them or anything, but I yeah. figured I would just you know let you know. Not sponsored. No, no, that's just a friend of ours, um, guys. Who's that? They're asking who AK is. Yeah, he's a friend of ours. Yeah. Action. <laughs> My dad paid $35 a night at Fountain Blue back in the 1960s, Perry oh, uh, Woke says. And $6 like that, a night at Vagabond Motel. My times. It's a great one. They redid that one. Yeah, there's Guys, no service over there. Does, has anybody. Oh, yeah, this is uh, spotty, too. It's weird. Right on here, even in North, even on the mainland. We're on the barrier island right now. No one can hear me, so. Uh, we hear you just fine. We're sea turtles. We are. We we hear you. Mark says my parents paid twenty dollars a night at Fountain Blue on their honeymoon back in the day. Oh, oh. nice. That's happy memories. CAK says looks like there's some dark clouds That's coming. That's what in. I said. Yeah, guys. That I is C -C exactly what we said. I'm like those clouds don't those look. Those look happy. very ominous, guys. They very look happy ominous. Clouds. Yeah, they do not look like... Clouds um, on Hudson's Dream Blanket. Yeah, like the clouds on Hudson's Dream Blanket, exactly. Foreboding, Dennis Reynolds says. We love our little Hudson, guys, you know that. Oh, PDX, uh, Jeff says, I'd love to see the inside of the St. Regis. Well, I did go in the lobby of the St. Regis, and we did, I mean, we're actually going to... St. Regis is the... Um, Cole. We did. We have a book, a book coming out this fall. The King Cole book. And we are highlighting um, the great bars in New York City. And we, we have interior photography that we took at the St. Regis. And I actually did a recorded video. We have to put that up. Yeah. Of the uh, inside of St. Regis Hotel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. we will be putting that up. Um, we, we, we're really backlogged with a lot of our videos. We got to, you know, yeah. get big. Oh, there's a big sea turtle at the end of that I block. I saw it. Yeah, yeah. <gasps> oh, we'll, we'll have, have to, to remember here. that. Yeah. That's how you get to 95 there. We're still pressing on. This is by Bell Harbor now, I think. Right. Oh, this is where, by where, do we walk this far south? No, no this is Bell Harbor now. That's what I was now. saying, we'll walk another Right, time. yeah. We stopped just uh, north of the um, mm -hmm. haul over. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so guys, Bell Harbor Mall is coming up on the left. And that is a beautiful shopping mall that's kind of like indoor, outdoor. It's like yeah. um, open to the we air. Live and from we've there. live streamed but from the there. But the service is terrible. It wasn't even that. They weren't that happy about having a service animal in the mall. Yeah, you know. Screw them. No, just kidding, guys. Hudson's not, you know. 
Hudson goes wherever Hudson pleases. There's exactly. the St. Regis right there. Yeah. Oh, oh here's the Saint. This St. Regis in Bell Harbor. Yeah. yeah. That we haven't been inside. Kate Summers remembers the reserve in Sunny Isles. Oh yeah, we. This is a Sunny Isles is going to be coming up, and we live streamed from there a couple of Saturdays ago, and we had a great time. I love the beach in Sunny Isles. Yeah, it was nice. Too. It was beautiful. It's a nice area too. Look yeah, at this palms. is gorgeous. Look at this, guys. Isn't the this palm stunning? Trees. Beautiful. Isn't it? Yeah, we walked as far as the pier, and then we didn't. We stopped going south. The Sunny Isles Pier that that night. <coughs> This is Bell Ask Mary says, New Wheels is your book on Amazon. Yes, Ask Mary. Thank you for asking. Our book that's currently um, it, uh, out right now is called Storefront NYC. Uh, that just uh, was released uh, September 2023. We had a book release party for all our... Um, anybody um, that follows us on YouTube will be having another book release party for our new book that's not yet out, but it will be published fall 2023, September, tw I mean, fall 2024. You got it. September of 2024, this year. It's called Great Bars of New York City. It is available for pre-order actually on Amazon. Yeah. You can find it on there. Save your, but our save book, your our, our book Storefront NYC, if you want to check it out, we have a website, jamesandcarlamurray.com. And we have some photos from the book so you can see what it's about. But it's all about um, small businesses in New York City. You know, there was a white tree that kind of reminds me of that white tree in... Um, Gondor? Yep. The white right tree of Gondor? Yep. Oh, my God. Look at those clouds, guys. Yikes. Holy moly. Those are storm clouds if I ever have seen one. What do you think, guys? Yeah, we're we're passing over. Are we going to be driving into a tornado again? I don't know. Look at Is that. Is there a tornado watch? Oh, my God. Guys. Guys, look up Holy. there. There's the uh, oh, ball wow. of inlet. Look at that. Look, you can see the inlet. Wow. It looks choppy. Choppy it as all. It always is choppy there. Look, it looks like it's raining that way. Wow. This looks very foreboding, guys. So don't this is Hallover. This is Hallover Park, guys. Don't Hallover. sleep in a pouring rain. Look at that nice fish they got. Wow. Here, I'm gonna. Put oh look, a, oh, a skate oh, park. Skate park. Hey, can you hold this for one yeah. second? I'm gonna put the external battery back on because yeah. we're we're you know. Look at the kids. They're having fun. Fun. I get on there. Guys, I'm gonna roll down the window for a second. I want to just show you. This is no filter. I'm rolling down the window because I put the. Look at that. This yeah, is no filter. Look, no filter. That is real. Look at those clouds. What do you think of those yeah, clouds, guys? The, uh... Holy possible tornado Batman, Damon Dunn is saying. Yeah, look at the kids in the skate park. Yeah. The BMX track. Yeah, look at the kids look having like a fun. Kid on a skateboard. He's good. The skateboarder. Holy wow, crap. he is really good. Holy oh, moly. Wow. wow. Yeah, he knew what he was doing. He did there. know what he was doing. Those kids, boy, I just heard someone scream. A dog park on the right too they're saying and a yeah. new beach and a new beach yeah <laughs> over has got everything guys got i'm gonna it. put up it. the window but i'll i'll turn down oh, i'll put down the, all this. i'm gonna put the window back down yeah this will be nice to walk along look there's a nice path they redid it all what did you say James? holy crap look how crowded it is wow it is crowded here Hall over. almost every space filled this is a little transmission -y. This is full. Don't sleep in the oh my subway, God, guys. darling. Look at that! Look at those clouds. My Alex Burrell says there's nothing that, that was doesn't nice, get Jimmy. Picnic, didn't it? Yeah, that doesn't get Jimmy singing. singing. Oh, no, I'm Alex Burrell loves your singing. Cloud songs in the chat. Celtic football supporter. Guys, think of songs with clouds. Oh my God! Look at here, Hudson. Clouds in my coffee. Clouds in my coffee. Look at that. Look at that. Soul Hall over Park. Look at that little lighthouse yeah, thing. Yeah, that's nice. You probably think this song is about you. Wow. 
that is cray cray. Little puffy clouds by the orb. Oh, that's a good one. 173rd and Collins is where Rascal House once was. Now I believe it's an Epicure restaurant. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, look, there's showers. That was showers yeah, there. Yeah, showers. So when you come off the beach. Oh, Hudson, 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 get back down. This is, it's too much. Showers. Hudson. I'm gonna take me a shower. Carly Simons. Uh, Clouds in my coffee house and boys shouting out. Look at these nice little shower areas. Look at how uh, cute they are. Wow. Yeah, they know what they're doing over here. And if only there was transmission. Yeah, only if there was a... Raining. Raindrops keep falling Guys, the rain head. has started. It's raining. Too big for his bed. Have you ever seen the rain? CCR, Alex yeah. Morel, perfect. It's with that. It just started raining. Alex, it's as if you called it. The windshield wipers are now on. Hudson perked up when he heard "New Beach." Yeah. Dennis Reynolds. Oh my yeah, God! Yeah, he's got the beach body for it. Look at him. He's strutting around out there, dropping his towel. Right? He dropped his towel. Walk her strut around. Wow! I'm glad I didn't go out on the beach because I would have gotten caught in this. Yeah. Baby, come out of the clouds. Damon Dunn. Oh, that's nice. a perfect. Dennis Reynolds, the Carpenters, LAVs, put up cloud emojis. Oh, I put up Jacob's Ladder. Clouds prepare for battle looming low and ominous. Oh, nice. good one, Brenda Nelson. Brenda Nelson, nice job, as always. Vincent says, oh, Hudson's so sweet and relaxing. Isn't he the sweetest boy? Guys, if you're, if you're just watching for the first time, you don't know who we're talking about. Hudson is our dog. He's right next to us. Mm. Here he is. Mm. Riders of the Storm, PDX Jeff, extra boom, good boom, one. Boom, boom. Perry Wilkes said they, they tore down some beautiful iconic motels in Sunny Isle of Sad. Yeah, I remember when they that one with the Sahara or something like that was that. Yeah, with the with the sheiks in the front. Yeah, the camel. The camels. The camels that's yeah, it. that's gone, right? The camels. Yeah, I think that's gone. And then another one that had a big cantilevered thing. Remember, like they tore that one down. I forget yeah. what that was called. Look, they're on their scooter. They're running inside. Oh my God, the rain is really coming down now. Guys, listen. Long as I remember. The rain keeps falling down. Clouds and mystery forming. Confusion on the ground. Hudson's the star, said Joseph. Uh, oh, Joe, Joe Morgan, 53. Try to find the sun. Hudson's so chill. He but is. Still, I wonder. Oh, this is how. Yeah, we where walked. We walked. Here. Yes. Yeah, I yeah. wonder. Raindrops keep falling the... on my head. Rain yeah. jeeps. Raindrops keep falling on my car. <laughs> yeah. Too big for his bed. Yeah, this is where the, the pier was, right now here. It's over. Remember, because we stood yeah, right yeah, out yeah, the opposite yeah, yeah. that. Yeah, yeah here did. comes the Sunny Isles Pier, guys. Crying's not for me. Mush mushroom cloud of his. Um, Damon Dunn saying, oh yeah. Stop the rain by complaining. Nothing's worrying me. And in true Florida fashion, just as quickly as it rains, it stops almost. Did you come on my side? Mm -hmm. Stayed in Sunny Isles a few times, says South Wolf. Oh, extra good. No, don't worry about it. Nothing worrying me. Let me grab uh, Hudson a uh, blanket. Don't know on. why. There's no sun up in the sky. Stormy weather. Don't know why. 
I'd love a real Cuban sandwich right now, oh, PDX Chef yeah, saying. Yeah. Oh, yep, it started raining again. Yep, started raining yeah. again. Uh-huh. Hudson, you gotta put your seatbelt on. Yeah, they're telling Hudson, get a seatbelt on. Look, people are coming in, you know, they're all running yeah, off the, the beach. No glass, no pets. Spring break, zero tolerance. Yeah, you hear No that? glass, no pets. Wow, they put those two together. Like, what's got one got to do with none another? The rain song, Led Zepp. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Rainy day and Monday. Oh, yeah, Dennis Reynolds. Rainy days and Mondays always get me down. down. Hey, you get off my... You get off of my cloud, Rolling yeah, Stones, Brenda Nelson, that's a great Brenda, one. Brenda, of course, nice job again. Vincent Padula says he would buy an album if James put it out of, of you know, your yeah. tunes that you sing. Yeah, James sings the rain songs. James's greatest album. Yeah. It's Raining Men, hallelujah. I'll Kate put on Summers. my best yeah. sport jacket. It's Raining Men, hallelujah. Look at all the gas, gas tanks. I guess they have a boat. Yeah. It's Raining Men. Amen. Every day. Sure. Oh. I can't remember the rest. Dark and sweet. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. Rainy day, Jimi Hendrix. Oh, that's yep. a classic. Purple rain, PDX Jefferson. Yeah, Prince. Of oh, Prince. Prince. What? A, I mean, you know, it's, every time I think of Prince, I just say, oh my God, it just—he yeah, died way shame. too young. Yeah. Way too young, guys. Yep. Oh, I remember this this beautiful ho um, yep. condo. Look at that big. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Isn't that crazy? The Jade Ocean. Oh, and there's the Darth Vader. It's, yeah. a, it's a Darth Vader. Look, it has yeah. no windows. Yeah. It's a Darth Vader building. It is. It's like that building it's, uh, in downtown Manhattan. What's that called? The Death Star. The Death Star. The Death Star. Here, let me turn these down. Mark says, is it cheaper in North Miami than South Beach? Well, not here. This is Sunny Isles. Sunny Isles is very expensive. I mean, I would say North Beach is probably like more reasonably priced. I don't, I don't wouldn't say it's cheap. I don't think anything mm. in Miami is cheap. Mm -mm. No, me neither. Seth Wolf says, shouldn't I say pa? I don't know. I can fire. I see it in rain. James Taylor. Ah. Rainy day woman. No, Sammy. I see fire and I see, see rain. rain. That's what it is. I've seen sunny days that I thought would never end. Sammy G, rainy day woman. Rainy day woman. B.J. Thomas, love that song, Mary Jane, saying raindrops keep falling on my head. And I do to me, man. The Soleil. Oh, is that the one we climbed and then uh, we came back down? Yeah. Yeah. All right, here's some serious car somewhere. See, everybody's coming off the beach because yeah. there's dark clouds. That's the park we went to. We visited that. Yeah. Look, new construction, there's the beach. Look at those ominous clouds over, over the beach, guys. Yeah, a lot of money spent in this spot. You got that right. Good morning, heartache. Sit down. This is A1A, guys. A1A, Beachfront Avenue. Yeah. The mansions at Aqualino. Oh, that's where we went. The mansions at Aqualino. We went up on the um, staircase here, like a, guys. A During our our live stream, we went we we went up on that staircase. Oh, there's an Il Molino restaurant here. That's in New York. That Il Molino. Il Molino. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's an expensive restaurant in New York. Il Molino, New York, it says. Lazy Lightning, Grateful Dead. Oh, nice. that's a great yeah. reference. Thunder and lightning. Oh, yeah, you know that it's frightening. Blue Star, On a Bus to St. Cloud, Trisha Yearwood. Wow. Nice, that's a great that's one. That's a good uh, reference, too. Yeah, Trisha Yearwood, absolutely. We have the best chat. We have the best chat ever. Yeah. I love these rain songs. Rains and clouds. That's what we're playing a game, guys, in case you're just tuning in. We're naming either rain songs or cloud song references. That is nice. It's Cherry Park back there. Yep. Think. You betcha. That's the post office and stuff. Yeah. The government center. Well, I gotta take my sunglasses off, huh? Dude, that might be good, huh? Yeah, I got so many glasses hooked to my t-shirt here. 
Just got a whole display. There you go. Yeah, put these in. These are more likely to repair. I lived in Greenwich Village on West 11th and 5th oh, Avenue. Nice. PDX Chef. Oh my God, that it that is almost like it's just so beautiful. Yeah, that, I love that area. That's our favorite area to walk in the Home West Village. It. Yeah, well, yeah it. it's making me homesick. It is. Yeah. However, you would love our storefront NYC book because there's a, we have a lot of. Uh, look at ben. Oh, look at this. The Bentley residences, and look like they have a little Bentley car mold, model right thing. Mold. Don't know. There's no sun up in the sky. So, guys, we're um, in Sunny Isles. Stormy flu. Look at that, the Bentley residences. Hmm. Wonder if a prerequisite to live in the Bentley residences is that you have to drive a Bentley. Yeah. <laughs> Family spring break vacation. Lots of older people and kids. Yep. Yeah. Moonlight. Yeah, this is more this is more like a residential area, guys, Sunny Isles. Oh, here's the um there here's the old Sahara. I was there's I thought the they Campbells. I thought they might have torn this down. Look, isn't that the funniest? That is awesome. The old Sahara um motel is still here. I had no idea. I thought they it looks like they're gonna tear it down soon, James. Yeah, Lawrence. We should really um photograph it. Did we have photographs Lawrence of it? Lawrence of Arabia. No, there's an people. English guy. People still sitting there. He came to fight the Turkish. Meet me. Look at it. Here's the Porsche design. The, the Porsche design. Another one where the. Do you have to own a Porsche? No, it comes with one. Yeah, do you own a and Porsche? Here are the keys to your free Porsche, sir. Yeah. Oh, thank you. No, so we hadn't parked yet. We were parked. Uh, by the government center. No, we did. Oh, okay. Here's the St. Regis. Slip Sales sliding gallery. in a way. Beautiful. The near your destination, the more you keep slip sliding away. You three are the best live streamers ever. Mary Jane says, Thanks, Mary Jane. oh, Mary Jane, thank you so much. That makes us feel so nice. Thanks for hanging out with us. We're so glad you're enjoying it. it. Thank yeah. you so much, Mary Jane. Yeah, you guys make make it great. The chat, our chat is the best chat. We really do. We have the best chat. We enjoy ourselves. That's, that's the, I think that's the key Yeah. is positivity. Stay positive. Enjoy yourself, guys. Yeah. Stay positive. Don't stress. Don't stress. Hold steady. Stay positive. The light turns will get we'll do it better. Splish splash. I was taking a bath. Okay, easy. Don't, don't rush that. Golden Beach. Golden says. Beach. That's what the area we're in now, guys. We're in the area called Golden Beach. There's some gorgeous homes along the water here. Oh, forget about this it. This is all beachfront homes on the right, guys. These are all beachfront homes. And then you see on the left is uh, more gorgeous mansions. Yeah. Golden Beach. Golden Beach is golden. Someone waiting for their Uber. See that? Uma Oprah. Remember Letterman? <laughs> that second Carla. That's our spare Carla we have. Yeah, because I lost the wide shot. That's why I needed that. Guys, sorry that um, I can hear you now. I'm using my second phone, so thanks, gu thanks, guys. What's the matter, you? Puppy brother says, "How do you not stress and worry?" <laughs> Puppy brother, you just um, when life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. That's well, you, that's well, what we try to do. Anything, so. Right. Is that you? Oh, 
Oh, Vincent says, I love talking to James and Carla on streaming. It's better than watching recorded ones. Yeah, everybody likes their thing. Some people like recorded videos. Some people like um, the live streams, you know? That's why we do both, because then then no matter what you prefer, you got the you got it. Yeah, you got On it. On our channel, you got a little bit of everything. It's a potpourri. It's a potpourri. A potpourri. A potpourri bag of live stream hijinks. Yeah. You know, we, we even do we even do Lego and puzzle builds where we chat with everyone. Yep. Oh, we're just entering Broward County. James. Uh, Guys, we're in no longer, longer in Miami-Dade County. We've just entered Broward County. This would be Hallandale Beach then. Yep. Does a soft shoe routine for you, Kate? We've got everything. We've got live. We got we got eating out, eating supporting small businesses. Uh -huh. yeah. Well, I meant dining yeah, videos. Yeah, dining. Yep, yeah, sure. We got Hudson uh, point of view. You know, Hudson recording his walks yeah. from his unique point of view. No matter what what you what you fancy. I think you might find it on yeah, James fancy. and Carla yeah, channel. Yeah, the whole kitchen sink. <laughs> we have videos of just James reading. We got everything but reading. the kitchen sink on you our channel. You read on the show. Yeah. You read on the show. Yeah. Brendan Nelson says, I love both, but I prefer the live streams. When life gives you melons, make melonade, is Alex Prowler saying. <laughs> oh, yeah. Crazy Auto says, or have lemonade and vodka, because that will work too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know Hudson's, it can't hurt. <laughs> Hudson says a mimosa? That sounds nice. Yeah, Hudson loves a mimosa. Look, we're in Hallandale now. Yeah, we're in Hallandale Beach. Look at that. There's some spring breakers. Look at how cute this is. Look at that. Look at how cute that water tower is. Painted like a beach um, ball. A beach ball. A colorful beach ball. How cute is that? I'm loving that. Yeah, and there's some blue sky. Yeah. Yeah, hold on one second, Chips. Yeah. Look, they still have lights on the palm trees. Beautiful. Thanks for hanging out on your Saturday, guys. Beautiful time here. We wanted to check out South Beach Spring Break uh, changes, right? Yeah, we did. Wasn't bad. Yeah. I just took a picture of that beach ball because I really liked it. And then, um, you know. Yeah. Bouncy, bouncy. Hallandale Beach. Wow, these little kids running across the street. Holy crap. Yeah, isn't that the cutest water tower? Yeah. I mean, I'm just loving it. I really like the one in Hollywood, too, that has the uh, sea turtles painted on it. Yep. But this one's really adorable. Yeah, you got water on the window, maybe. Yeah. Oh, sorry, guys. This will be clearer. The side window is a little dirty from r r driving in the rain. This is a little, little nice. Look, tea, turtle nesting. March through October. Guys, it's sea turtle nesting yeah. time. I saw you Walk and in. him walking, walking in, in the, the rain. rain. Oh, hey, Ruby. Ruby's joining in. Hi, Ruby. Nice to see you tonight. Orange Juice Jones. Kiss me when it rains. Barbara Streisand. Oh, oh yeah. my God. Oh, everybody wants to see Hudson in his floppy ears. Here you go. Like an easy chair. Love. There's the Austin. love boat. The love boat. Set a course for excitement and joy for a new, new romance. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, James, you make me laugh. Oh, this is so much fun. Rich Corinthian leather. The diplomat. Oh, yeah. Resort. Guys, so after Hallandale Beach is Hollywood. Now, Hollywood. Hollywood. Oh, look, the diplomat landing is the infamous site of our La Tub incident. We'll call it the, the incident. whole the whole reason why we're driving a rental car right now will be coming up shortly. Coming soon, a Publix right there. No, oh, very nice. I wonder if they're parking. You know, they come. Oh yeah. Look, look right out. There's beach, uh, beach, beach access. Yeah, hard to say. Hudson says, "I'm not getting any younger. Let's do something." Dennis Reynolds, m meaning Hudson. Hudson is very patient. 
he's really very patient and he's perfectly happy not having to walk around in the heat. Now the temperature did drop. Remember it rained and it's now only 82 degrees Fahrenheit. So that's not bad for walking around. But when we started the video, it was 90 degrees Fahrenheit. And Hudson said, I'd prefer to stay in the car. Right. And stay in the air conditioning. They call Hudson Chuck. Carla, you go out and walk on the beach. Yes, yeah, Chuck Chill. You, you go out in the, on the hot sand. I'll just stay here and keep my little, my little pad paws nice and nice and chilled. Yeah, on my dream blanket. On my, on my dream James blanket with clouds. James even turned on the radio for me. Exactly. He kept telling me what station. Exactly. No. No. Oh, Aus Fly Girl says, please recap the, the, the La Tub incident. Well, guys, what, ha what happened was we were dining. Uh, we were t uh, going out to lunch with Nick G and his lovely wife, Karen, who Nick G. flew in from the UK. Nick G is one of our channel moderators. He and his wife, Karen, came out and we took them to lunch at La Tub. See, there's like parking there, but it must, you know, look like a yeah, paid lot. Yeah, you know. I see. Um, That's where these lots get a little right. shaky. And we went to a place called La Tub. It's a waterfront dining on the Intracoastal in Hollywood Beach. Now, they're famous for their, their, their hamburgers. All four of us ordered hamburgers. Boomba Club! And, you know, the hamburgers are, I mean, it was fair. It was busy when we walked, when we got, when we drove oh, in. Oh, no, you're drinking this too long. And we parked the car. It's a, you pay $2 and you, you park your own car, but it's a, it's a manned lot. Like there's an attendant. No skateboards. So glass while we were eating, at some point during the meal, our car was hit by the work van that had been parked next to Contractors. us. Contractors. They were doing work at La Tub. They had an orange work van. And... If they had just fessed up to it and told us that they hit our car while we were dining there, Hook her up, buttercup. I mean, that would have been bad enough, but at least they would have been admitted to it. What they decided to do was to, to cover up the fact that they hit the car, and they tried to repair it themselves, and they used wood screws, bathroom caulk, and what looked like black nail polish to repaint the car. And they created a Tried huge, to hide it. Right, they tried to hide it. Which, I mean, it did work initially because when we first got to the car, we didn't notice it. But when James turned the car on, all these lights came on saying that the, the daytime running light was no longer working. Lo and, and behold. And the, um, the driver's side front, front signal indicator light was also not working. But since we, since we were, you know, live streaming, we were with Nick G and his wife Karen, they were in their car. They had a rental car. We, Shit, didn't, we didn't stop and like, you know, look at the lights or anything like that. We just drove on. And to make a long story short, later that night we discovered the um, the uh, the repair, so the so-called repair. Yep. And then the next day we had to go back to the to the place, and and they had security cameras, and we met with the the owner, and I mean. Wow, look at all this. So anyway, now... What's going on over here? Billy Stone Crab wow. restaurant. It's, uh, you know... No, look, there's a whole... Yeah, police activity. Police response. So at any rate, our car is being is in the repair shop now. So to me, that's a very brief yeah, they tried part to cover of the story. It up. Made it is, worse. Right, that our car was hit while we were parked. We were not in the car. We were not injured. Everybody was fine. But they did, um, you know, a couple thousand dollars worth of damage to the car hit and run exactly that's exactly what they did whoa, dc322 whoa, whoa, whoa. okay they 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 hit the car they tried to to repair it so he wouldn't notice it and then they drove away so oh, yeah i don't know what this police activity is but something's happening at billy's stone crab restaurant tonight tonight wow weird wow there's people should, with cell phone cameras looking at it i mean yeah. this has created quite a uh quite a buzz quite a controversy here Wow, Saturday night. Look at this. Look at this activity. Hollywood strip here. Holiday. Look at Gigi's Hollywood. on the water. That, now that's owned by the same people that own La Tub, by the way. Yeah, different owners at La Tub, guys. We talked about. We right. touched on that. La Tub used to be owned by, um, a, you know, was independently. I mean, it's still independently owned, but now it's part of a, a family that owns three restaurants in the area. I don't know why everybody out here is like looking with their hand over their mouth and yeah. clutching their teeth. And They're very interested. Interested. No, I mean, it's something must have happened. Yeah. We don't know. No skateboards. 
Secure your vehicles, no glass valuables. on the beach. Oh, valuable. Yeah, secure your Hudson. Yeah. So now this is Margaritaville. Now this is La Tub right across the street here. This is where this is where the incident happened, and that's exactly where we parked the car. Yeah. Right, right over right there. Right there. Right by yeah. the tiki hut. Oh, Chloe is me says, do you guys live in Florida? No, we, we, we split the time between Florida and um, and New York. We split the time, guys. We go back and forth um, a couple of times a year. You're busy here. No one goes to Hollywood anymore. Oh, uh, You're crowded. the last time I seen you guys, you were eating Haitian bread. Oh, Chloe is me. We love the Haitian bread. Oh, the Creole bread. Oh, the Haitian um, We're bread. We're due to go there, guys. It's the Creole bread, the pan de Creole. A little butter in the morning. Oh, oh my God. That's our up. favorite place. Eat uh, it while it's hot and fresh. What's that place called? Uh, the Pim bakery. Pimambook, exactly. Pimambook. Creole bread. Oh. Asin Boy says, how ironic, I just saw a black Mercedes leaving the tub. Yeah, what a big So time. guys, this is the Margaritaville. Wasted away again. Wasted away in Margaritaville. Looking for my lost seeker of soul. Wow, so I guess a lot of vacationers came to Hollywood. That's just busy yeah. here, huh? Yeah, it's nuts. Look at this. Saturday night in Hollywood, busy. Busy. You put the boom boom into my heart, let me tell you. Yeah, so guys, unless you uh, oh ha have a reservation or you're planning on waiting a while. Yeah, um, don't go to La Tub right now. Well, La Tub, I don't know if they, I don't think they take reservations, to be honest. They don't know how to hold <laughs> the reservation. Yeah. And that's the most important part. Exactly. To, you got to hold the reservation. Anyone can take a reservation. There are a lot of small hotels uh, along, that's cute, yeah. along here. This uh, Hollywood Beach is always fun to drive along. They run North Ocean Drive if you're just joining in Hollywood Beach. It's a, it's a really pretty spot. The beach is beautiful. And not only are there resorts like Mar Margaritaville, there's public parking, and there's lots of um Yeah, we're driving right along the coast the whole way. Right along the coast. There's some spring breakers. Yeah, we figured we would just keep on going on A1A. Um, Beachfront Avenue. Really, until, like, basically you're forced off because of um, the government cut. I think that's... Um, yeah, that's just, then it goes to it, A1A and Route 1 join for a while. Exactly. And then it goes back to A1A on 17th Street Causeway. Right, back, back in Fort Lauderdale. So guys, this is the beach right here in Hollywood Beach. There's a, a broadwalk, they call it. It's not a boardwalk, it's called a broadwalk because it's cement. Maserati. Yeah. Uh, Gran Turismo. It's always five o'clock somewhere. Alex Braille, you saw that across the way from Margaritaville, right? Yeah. Yeah, that was the name of that little spot. It's cute, right? Oh, watch out. There's some uh, police activity again, James. Yeah, what happened here? I don't know if there was an accident. What is Something. going on here? Looks like an accident. Yeah. Oh my, I hope everyone's okay. They look okay. Oh, he swipe swiped them. Oh wow. Oh wow. That Lost was a lot of damage. Rash on there. Yeah. Hmm? Something. Yeah. It's pretty great. I gotta pay attention. Look at that AMG. Wagon. Oh, yeah, that's wow, that's serious. Yeah, that's right? the fastest production car right now. Yeah, ju I don't know if you saw it because it was just a split AMG second. AMG Mercedes. But James wagon. just saw an I AMG it out Mercedes uh, wagon. Super fast. So there's lots of public parking um, here oh, in Hollywood yeah. Beach. Yeah, that's right. Oh, okay. Yeah, let me see uh, the next one. Look at that, guys.
So guys, because the sun is setting, we thought we would have liked to show you the sunset right here. And that way you get to see sweet boy Hudson. He gets to sniff because um, he, he, could, um, he could probably use a little sniffy, sniffy do time, right James? Let's get Hudson out of the car so he can, so he can sniff a little bit. There he is. There he is. See the cloud blanket? Isn't it cute? I know, but we're going to just be right here, James. Yeah. Oh, look at this, guys. This is beautiful. Look, there's a yacht right here. We'll stay right here in the corner, James. Oh man, someone's grilling. It's making me hungry. Oh my God. Oh, this is a... Oz Fly Girl just sent us $10 Super Chat to watch the sunset. Oh my God, guys. James, come over here. Talk about the, this yacht. Yeah. This, is a, this is a serious yacht, guys. Yep, steel, ocean going. Atlas is a serious... That's Rever a steel Negative camber hull. windows in the front, just like a tugboat. Steel hull. That can go out and the... Tra anywhere, that's, anytime. That can make a transatlantic crossing. Yeah. It can go anywhere, anytime. That's the crew up top washing yeah. her down. She's working. That so. is a gorgeous boat. Yeah, look at the, look at the uh, beach club in the back. We're going to look that one up, Atlas. The cockpit. Yeah. And what a stunning sunset. Yeah, look at this. Here's fishermen over here. Look how pretty this is. Yeah. Guys, blood pressure. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, I'm, thanks, I'm, Vincent. I'm wanting to invite ourselves over to that. Um, yeah, it smells good, huh? To that. Hey. Yeah, I'm gonna let um, I'm gonna let Hudson pee. Sure, I Here, can just. You, oh, you want to stay there for a second? Oh, I see Thanks for that. Yeah, look at this. Absolute. Yeah, now when it's hot in Miami, right? Back and forth. Chloe's me. Keep an eye on that. I'll stay here, yeah. I'll just walk, you know, here. Well, just so we can... I'm just letting him, I'm just letting Hudson sniff around. I think what he's trying to do is, yeah, he wants to lead me to where they're, they're picnicking. So what he wants is, he, he wants to grab their hamburger. So we're not gonna let, we're not gonna have him disturb their meal. Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? Guys, there could be manatees here. Oh my God, how pretty is this? Osvago says it's so nice. Thank you so much. Oh my God. Guys, let me show you, let me show you something. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Oswager. Oh, how pretty is this, guys? There it goes, off into the night. Guys, thanks so much. Wonderful day. Wonderful afternoon. Yeah, guys, so thank you so much for watching. We had so much fun today. So Miami Beach, our thoughts, Extra very good. safe. It was very safe. Uh, did a good job of uh, keeping it safe. It was beautiful. The beach looked spectacular. We had so much fun showing it to you. And also Greg the B. drive. The drive back up to Broward County and to gorgeous. Hollywood Beach was gorgeous. And what, I mean, I can't think of a better way to end this video than this gorgeous sunset right here overlooking the intracoastal waterway. Yeah. So guys, thanks so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new to our channel so you can uh, enjoy more of these videos. And uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm not sure what we'll have in store, but we'll definitely do something tomorrow too. So guys, thanks for the super chats and thanks, super CAK, stickers as Thanks, Aussie well. Fly Girl. Yeah, we really appreciate thanks it. Thanks everybody, Vincent, the whole bit.
Bye, guys.